Wilson out of the backfield. They set up the screen, but instead it's an interception. Chandler Martin to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, Memphis. Wilson into the end zone. His second touchdown of the game. And to his left. Hands it to him, and Watson stumbles, keeps fighting. Ball comes out. Charlotte recovers. Over 150 yards rushing. This time it's the Banga up the middle. Bangs his head on the goal post for a touchdown. He's the tight end that's lined up at the H-back spot. They give it to Watson. Walks into the end zone for a touchdown. This time, Trexler Ivy pulls it and they dump it off to Weber. And Weber's got another big play. Down to the 15, down to the 10, inside the five yard line. Wilson trying to pick his way into the end zone and he does it again. Hennigan swings it out to Watson. Stays on his feet, backs into the end zone for a Tigers touchdown. Here at Jerry Richardson Stadium is on its feet. Tanner Gillis trying to tie this game at 38 with 40 seconds to play. Snap, hold, kick, dead center. We are tied at 38. A 41-38 lead. And it is no good. He left it out to the right. And off to Blake Watson, trying to bounce it out. He goes into the end zone, and the Memphis Tigers come from behind and win on the road in overtime. Dwayne Thomas for a big play. Jones following blockers, and he's in for a Charlotte touchdown. On the board on fourth and three. Flynn back to pass. Taking a shot down the sideline, and Johnson. Zone read. Jones pulls, gets rid of it, completes it. In hey. Bird dancing, giving up some ground. Yeah. This would tie a season long for a Charlotte kicker. Has the distance, but he missed it. Flynn to pass, looking for the end zone up high, and it is caught for a touchdown. Jones, rainbows over the middle, he's got a tight end wide open. Would be a career long for Larson. Played well. They still have an opportunity right here to go take the lead. Flynn, pressure off the edge. Flynn is sacked. Jones, late pitch. Bird. ECU has done nothing. First and ten. Flynn steps up. Has room to run, and he will do just that. Trying to need to gain another 30 yards to feel real comfortable. Flynn on the wheel route. So well did he hang on? Yes, he did, and a flag comes out. Two for four from 40 to 49 this season. For the tie. It's no good. A motion Burton. Richardson gets now quick. It's batted up in the air and picked off. The other way goes UAB for a pick six. It kind of puts you a little bit behind the eight ball. Richardson steps up in the pocket and runs. There he goes, breaking a tackle inside the 20 to the 10. Oh, and a flag comes in late after the hit. New back set with Lewis. And there's West. Wester finds a seam and scores. Again. Richardson. Lofting it sideline and a back shoulder grab is made. Before something came open. UAB brings the pressure. Richardson, end zone. Wester got him. Touchdown FAU. The most original plan or play to draw up, but with their big quarterback trying to get the yardage, seemed logical. Roll out for Richardson. He's got Wester wide open and he's got him in stride. LaJonte Wester makes a cut. Spins inside the 10, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown, FAU. Short of the first down. Punt sent away by Foley. Wester back there to return because, of course, he is. Scoops it up around the 35. Makes a move at midfield. Wester is loose. Still spinning into UAB territory and down to the 35. Hard-nosed runner in the middle of the, 
offense as we see right there. There he is, Kobe Lewis right up the gut, in for six more. Oh, we were talking to Tom Herman about it. Most significant athletic achievement in the school's history, he was saying. On the end around, oh, there's a gigantic hit. Oh, UAB's got to get this offense going. Jacob Zeno trying to engineer a tying drive. He's got his man wide open, streaking down the field. Tejon Palmer, goodbye. Touchdown, UAB. Four-man FAU rush. On a crosser, that's complete to Brown again. Breaking tackles in the FAU territory already. FAU rushes four. Zeno on a crosser. There's Palmer inside the 10 for the win. Snap and hold, good. Kick on the way, and it is true. And UAB takes the lead with three seconds to play here in Birmingham. Yeah, they, they switched the coverage from the man to cover two. Four-man pressure, deep down the middle, caught at the 40-yard line. Bounties on the right side. Johnson follows him, Ooh. and he's in. Touchdown, SMU, and is the running back. Excuse me, Thomas, touchdown. No doubt about that one. Stone going deep again, back shoulder and making the catch of Smith. And now. What a drive by SMU, and it's capped off by Knighton. Loss, and they are eliminated from the race. Start of the fourth quarter, Tiger football, down a touchdown, and they are running to even it up, and Blake Watson is in. And he's got it, so the Mustangs go back on top early in this fourth quarter. Second down and ten. Preston Stone feels the pressure, avoids, lobs it over the top, caught it midfield. Championship game hopes alive. Stone will throw for it. Back shoulder, caught, touchdown, SMU, Jordan Hudson. A one on the outside. Second and ten, Hennigan. The football tries it right up the middle and SMU is able to fall on it. Take it away. He'd like to pin one down inside the five-yard line somewhere. And he's not going to get it that far. Oh, oh maybe he did. Time. No, 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 no. He thought, I think, Marcy, the ball appeared to, to kind of gain momentum right Correct. when it That's what right I thought it I saw. Right there. Yep. After further review, the ruling on the field stands. First and ten, Navy. I should have stayed out of it with you, too. Positive yardage completion. Actually, the second completion of the day. Now, yeah, to Lavatai. Now he's got some room. Ty Lavatai. Army can't get him until he gets out to the 46-yard line. Oh, another one. Lavatai. Love it. Near Love side, it. first down. Love it from left. This one's a little shorter than that, and it's perfect. Lavatai, heavy pressure, the ball's out, scooped up by Army. Fortner, taking it to the end zone. Die down the middle, got it, he did convert it. Yep. Ed Chipman at the 43 of Army with a first down. Lavatai, plenty of time. Throws out near side, another first down, run out of three minutes. Lavatai, same spot, Umbarger again, same result. Pick yards off. From the 14-yard line, pump fake, and now the crosser, and a touchdown to Umbarger. Lavatai throws, it hit his receiver, but incomplete. Corner blitz coming. Bryson Daly getting every inch out of it. Not very good. If this backs up the wrong way, it did. Not very good. Oh, boy. Look at that. They only gained, what, 10 yards on the punt? Second and one. Lavatai. Deep him middle. Again. Got him. All right, that really doesn't matter. It's two down territory. Another hitch. Come on. You heard hit. Cushions all over the field. Lavatai goes the other way. He's got the receiver that way, too, down to the 10-yard line at Chapman. Lavatai throws in the flat. Teska, he's down at the one and a half. Fortner Fourth. saved a touchdown. And now straight ahead, Lavatai did not get there, I don't think. Or did he? It's going to end 
on the one foot line. It was a 10 play drive. They needed 73 yards to get to the end zone, and I think they got to 72 and a half. It's an FCS freshman All-American a season ago. Empty set. Third and 14. Rodgers heaves it, and it's caught by Cleveland. Third and four. Rodgers stepping up, trying to pull through a fistful of jersey. Play fake. Rodgers a dart. Touchdown. Hennigan on first and ten. Outside the numbers. Completes it. Hennigan pulls it back, fires, and completes it to Rock Taylor. Hennigan keeps it, and Hennigan going for it. Hennigan, outside throw. It's dropped. Second and 12, Rodgers to the air. Ward, red basket catch made. It's out of timeouts. Third down, Rodgers completes it. Down to a minute left, first and 10. Rodgers bombs it. Burns oh. with the catch. To set this receive, this defensive back up. Rodgers bouncing, scrambling, firing, touchdown, North Texas. First and 10, Hennigan spins it, out route. Caught by Drake out of bounds at the 45. Nine here. Hennigan, a dart, it's caught, Hennigan first and ten, approaching a half minute, Hennigan, screenplay, Watson, stretching towards the sideline, third and three, Memphis, Hennigan stepping up, chucks it for the end zone, and it's caught, it's a Memphis touchdown, Wow! 33 yard touchdown from Seth Hennigan to Joseph Skates, and Memphis is back on top. Ball on the ground. Tyler Levine, touchdown. Defenses in the country. Jenkins scrambling, avoids the rush, throws on the run. And is that a catch? Yes! <laughs> Landing <laughs> ransom goals. It's close. What's his hip down oh, yeah, first? Yeah, that's what I, I was looking at. Wow. Great effort. That looks, that looks like, like, a like a catch. catch. That game. After Once again. The, play, the receiver maintaining control. It is a completed pass. The snap. Handoff. Over the top goes Connors. Touchdown. Rice. Second and four. To the ground. Ooh. Connors reversing course. Which way did he go? Up the middle. Dean Connors with the burners. Broke down in the red zone. Jennings flushed out. To try to pick it up on his own. He throws it and completes his receiver over the middle. It would be a season long for Colin Rogers. To make it a five point game. Kick on the way. Got it! Jenkins, the backup, out of the shotgun. Fires one downfield, he's got a man! Picked off! Play clock down the three on the snap. Stone will put some air to it. Throws this deep ball so nicely in a first down. That's Brent. Second down, trying to bounce to the outside, and there's the speed of Knight. Into the second wave, stripped of the ball, it's loose, picked up by Oklahoma. He checks into the game. Fourth and a yard, right back to that winning recipe. It is Arnold up the middle. Boy. Stone looks, throws, contact downfield, and a flag flies. Roy, the transfer from Wake into the game. Second down up the middle, and there's a hole, and look at the run by Knighton. Levine is the big back. He's a decoy. Wide open, front of the end zone. Touchdown, SMU. Two left. Stone, flush from the pocket, floats. 
and it's caught. Bailey coming back to it, holds it in. Gabriel as he'll try to get things started. First down from the 25. Pressure comes, he's forced to dump. Nifty little move by Walker up to the 30, 35. All OU behind the sticks. Tenth play of the drive, and the pass is caught by Farouk. Into the five, touchdown! Fourth and five, Stone darts it. Dangerous throw, and it's broken up. Incredible success in Big 12 championship games, 11-1 during that time. Look at the moves by Major, high stepping his way to six. Dixon goes in motion. Sooners with initial breakthrough, but Stone again just continues to show composure. Second down. Stone throws it high and it's picked off. Harrington goes into the victory slide. Four-man rush, Warner across his body, David Martin Robinson with a first down, and lost the football, scooped up by South Florida. It's like Tulane was a part of last year, beating USC in the Cotton Bowl. Warner intercepted, oh, a big man pick, and a big man touchdown. USF drops eight. Warner stepping up to the end zone, and it's caught for the touchdown. Warner almost broken up somehow on target to Reese Clark. Warner off his back foot, caught in stride and a touchdown. Brown to the air, well protected to the sideline. And who else but Sean Atkins? Albin moves over as a fullback. Play action and Pratt hides it beautifully. Wide open is Brown. You'll keep Brown for the touchdown. Beyond the line of scrimmage, no intentional grounding. Second and ten. And Jennings buys some time to pump fake. Jennings with a first down and a little bit more. 51 yards coming against Rice from just inside the right hash. And Rodgers. You can tell this stage has not flustered him. Jennings buys a little bit of time, flips it ahead, and something out of nothing, and it could be close to another first down. A make from 48, a miss wide right from 40, and this attempt from 32. 133 teams in the country, so I don't know how you would penalize SMU for basically playing two power five teams. A sophomore from Prattville, Alabama. Gets underneath it and connects. Oh. Third and five, they'll run it with Clayton Johnson, and I don't think so. Tulane needs five. Pratt, Cox, and fires, and intercepted! The worst loss of the year between Alabama and Texas, and that set back in Dallas to Oklahoma. Rodgers connects from downtown. Legacy here at Tulane, and his team was a worthy champion. Pratt! By this defense, by defensive coordinator Scott Simons. By SMU's program overall. On fourth and goal, Bauman dropped it right at the goal line, and that'll just about do it. Mitchell of the Golden Hurricane. Oh, they come after it and block the punt. And it trickles out of the back of the end zone. Defense, which even against Power 5 teams, has been spectacular this year. Going back to the beginning of the season. Rutledge on the return, and he lost it. Ball is out. Tulsa on top of it. I can even see number seven. On the sideline, I don't see him. Watkins breaking free. Five point game. Pressure off the edge. Flea flicker. Ivy. Oh, he's got his man just inside the five yard line. This is three for three on third downs. Sets up a first and ten. And again to Anthony Watkins. And a double digit game. Here. Second and goal. It's Watkins. Sidestep. Dives into the end zone. Touchdown, Tulsa. Ivy over the middle has his man Mack in a foot race across the 30 and dragged down by Xavier Lanier. Bobbled snap, ball still on the ground and recovered by Ben Kapensky. Tulsa has it. Ivy over the middle connects first down and more. Hestera inside the 20. Touchdown, Jack has
Terra. Try on the tight ends here. I've a pass, flushed out, maintains possession, and he's got it. Francis towards the sideline, air underneath it, and caught. Ice in his veins, Meyer ties the game at 26. Showing the other team if you can capitalize and get this in the end zone. And the tush push is successful. Okay. I don't see why not. You, st you still got the time is not the issue. And that pass is intercepted. Dante Balfour ends the game for Charlotte in overtime. Oh. Rauschenberg drills it. Screen for Jamori Macklin. Macklin hops out of a tackle. Macklin across the 30. It is. I like one on one with Macklin. Here is Rodgers, floating it to the end zone for the touchdown! Second half, they were down 28-14 at the break. Rodgers protected, flag is down, sides is open for the touchdown, his second of the game! Team that is a tough, hard-nosed type football team. Zeno wires it, caught! Tejon Palmer! Trying to leave everyone in the rear view! Palmer, bye-bye! 80 yards for a touchdown! Where he uses his back as a shield. A day he plows in for the touchdown. It's a close game. Come on now. Third and seven. Zeno off his back foot. Fine skull Brown. First down and a lot more. Brown inside the 20. And corkscrew down near the 10. First and goal. BB lowers the shoulder for the touchdown. Shin, that's just a good throw and catch there. Now Adeyi with space. Ayo Adeyi to the corner. And pushed out at the 30 of UAB. Rauschenberg nails it. That's how you cap a career. Build more, you'll see more explosive plays and better play from their offense. Nice cutback run by Roy Dell Williams. Gets to the sideline, looking for the pylon and gets brought to get going vertical. Straight ahead run, Roy Dell Williams. He's in for the touchdown. They get the snap off. Out of the pocket again is Brown. He's got an alleyway. He's got a first down and more. He's got a cutback. Inside the 30-yard line of Alabama goes Byron Brown. They've gone for it five times. The throw is Simpson. It'll be thrown down. That's time. They are. Pulling it down is Brown. Into the right flat. First down, Weston Wolf. That time they fake bully balls. For this young man, so I'm not surprised here in the fourth quarter that that's who they're going to. Play action again. A shot into double coverage, and it's intercepted in the end zone. Takes the snap with nine on the play clock. Roydell Williams. Bounces it to the left-hand side. He's in the open field. Across the 50. And finally slides down inbounds with quarterback sneak. And that will put Ty Simpson across the line to gain. But by not calling their final timeout, even if they were to get a stop, the game would be all but over. There's the quarterback sneak. There's the push for Ty Simpson. And there is the salt and away touchdown for Alabama. Second and ten. Barnes. And Barnes is loose straight up field. Kavorian Barnes, all the way down to the 20-yard line of Houston. 2023, where he just has not been in a groove. And that's another pick, his third interception throw, the second takeaway for Malik Fleming. Smith has a moment, fires, and the juggling catch is made by Joseph Manjack the fourth. Smith floating one for the end zone, and Matthew Golden has a Houston Cougar touchdown. They have Kabor Kaborian Barnes lined up out wide. They need two. Can he get the first? The throw is caught, leaping in the air and falling. Go here if you miss, and that'll be a strategic discussion on that sideline. The catch. He's going to get the first down. It's Charles oh. Cephas. He's going to get the touchdown for the Roadrunners. An all Texas clash. And hits Houston over a UTSA. And he did drive the pile out to the 31-yard line, so that should move the chains.
an Alabama's look, a Georgia's look when they've had a national championship run. Back to throw Castellanos here, third and long. Wide open receiver is Bob, first down and more into, uh, check that, Dino Tomlin on the catch. Mike Tomlin's son. show again into the end zone. Touchdown, Boston College. Now Litton shifts everybody to the other side. And it's just a squib kick. And it's muffed initially. Ball still on the ground at the 25-yard line. BC might have it. The Eagles are signaling that they've got the ball. They do! Points now an empty set for the quarterback Thomas Castellanos design run Castellanos hit pinballs forward and appears to be short by about a yard at the five yard line it'll be fourth and one Florida State trying to go to three and zero and take its number three ranking to Death Valley to play Clemson noon ABC next week dump ball pass to Ophelia out space Bump with the ball it's loose it's picked up at the eight and into the end zone for the touchdown Castellanos out of the gun Dropping back into the end zone. Steps up. He has some room over the middle. He's past the 15, getting the first down out to the 18. Bill Castellanos hits the turbo and gets a first down. Now he'll throw on first down. Everybody covered. Castellanos holding on. Receiver comes free. It's caught at the 40-yard line. Breaking tackles his bond. And out of bounds. The ball got poked away, but it went out of bounds. 31-22. Castellanos to throw on first down. Pressure in his face. Throws a deep ball, and it's caught at the 15-yard line. Ryan O'Keefe pulls it in. 25-yard gain. Back. Castellanos will keep it. Trying to get the edge. He does. Into the end zone. Touchdown, Boston College. Negative play. So second down 11. Credit the front of Florida State. Now Castellanos to throw. Gets hit in the backfield and sacked. Back at the 12 for a loss of nine. Now you're third and 20 from the 12-yard line. Castellanos back to throw in trouble again. Stepping up, throwing downfield, pulled in for a first down at the 40-yard line. Ryan O'Keefe. Does Florida State come after him here? Five-man rush, he's in trouble. He's tripped up and keeps his balance. And now sacked back at the 25-yard line. The ball comes out. State. They're going to run it on third down and long, and they do not get the first down. And a penalty flag comes in, though late. It was a late flag thrown on the far side at the 40 yard line. Toa Feely down short of the line to gain by wow. about three Personal yards. Face mask. Oh, my goodness. Defense number 35. 15 yard penalty on an automatic first down. Shipley to the goal line. Touchdown! His second touchdown of the day, his first rushing touchdown of the season. Phil Maffa! Phil Maffa! Phil Maffa all the way to the Florida State 30. What a run! The longest for their team this year. Here's a blitz, and Plumnick didn't see it coming. He got blasted by Kalen Deloach. Who has the ball and is heading toward the end zone? Touchdown, Florida State. Jordan Travis up the sideline. What a catch! A hands catch by Johnny Wilson. FSU three for 11 on third down. Travis after the punt. Target for a first down to Johnny Wilson that he didn't see. Conservative play call, but Shipley gets to the 48 of Florida State. And again, now you don't have that timeout. Second and nine. Jordan Travis throwing in a single coverage and the catch made. They keep firing those jump balls and that. Touchdown. Mission by his quarterback, Jordan Travis. A moment ago, Nate Wiggins injured on that long fourth down play. So he's working against Jaden Lucas, the young sophomore, talented player. 
But a guy that's about a yard and a half that they have to have or it's ball game over. Klubnik deflected and incomplete. Florida State wins at Clemson. Of course, that'll help you get back in rhythm. As they got the ball to Jacquez more and more with the best run of the night for Duke. Another pre-snap penalty for Notre Dame. He'll go to the ground, driving, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown for Jordan Waters. Duke starts up front. Hartman tries to get away, and he does not. Trey Freeman wrapped him up. Go to the air here. Pressure coming. They pick it up well, and Leonard completes it. He's got Jordan Moore. Moore across the 50 and just into Notre Dame territory. Now Leonard, down the sideline, Leonard's got great wheels, Riley Leonard inside the 20. He stays on his feet, the strong run from Waters, Waters still driving toward the goal line. What a run, what an effort by Jordan Waters. Try to pay it off. Leonard has a man wide open. It's a touchdown to Jordan Moore. And O'Reilly Leonard with the pooch punt can do get down and cover it. And they do. The kid does it all. 360 dunks. He can run. He can lead. He can throw. Hartman and who else? He finds Mitchell Evans is tight end. And they break that drought on third down and keep the game alive. How about the freshman? Watch his route right here. He actually takes the defender with him, the middle linebacker, Cam Dillon, and it opens it up right there. Nice job of being patient, waited as long as he could with that pass rush, but a heck of a read and throw. Six catches, a buck 34 for Evans tonight. Hartman down the middle again. He's got Rico Flores. Flores still on his feet, and he's down to the Duke 41. Hartman back to work, taking a shot. Throws it to the outside, and Merriweather had it in his hand, but a flag comes out. Yeah, think, they may get that on Tobias. Yeah, I think he, he pushed off. On Al Blades Pass Jr. Offense yeah. number five, 50 yard penalty, first down. Murrayweather had a step, and he re the, based on the way he reacts, you can see that right arm extend on Al Blades Jr. Al Blades Jr. right away saying, "Hey, <laughs> help me out here, man! I'm on an island as it is." See that green line? They need to at least get it there. There it comes again. Hartman gets away, and he has to throw it, and it's almost intercepted, and it's fourth down. That time he brought Brandon Johnson. We just talked about how they're doing a good job of mixing up looks. You get pressure out here. He's disguising. He comes late, and he actually gets in to affect it. Nobody accounts for him. I'd love to see a defensive coach, the game on the line, instead of just being careful, that's our culture, right? We are an aggressive defense. Fourth and 16. Hartman has a chance to run for it. Can Sam get there? He came up short against Ohio State, but tonight he moves the chains on fourth down. Now he wants to fire it. He's trying to hold on to that timeout. Smart play. Are you kidding me with Sam Hartman? A 17-yard run on 4th and 16. Estime, it's loose! Hendrick Estime! Touchdown, Notre Dame! Give it's timeouts, but first the two-point conversion. Hartman, throwback. It's good. It's a seven-point game. And Leonard hit. Ball's loose. And Leonard is clutching his ankle. And the football's still loose. But, and it's Notre Dame football. 
14 were heartbroken, devastated, and uh, I'm sure there is a lot wow. of anger in Tallahassee as a result of this. Just a terribly unfortunate set of circumstances. They left Mike Norvell, who has done a fabulous job at Florida State, put the Seminoles in position. And now Near side, that's caught. And a first down into Georgia Tech territory. Here's the blitz. Complete, first down, thrash. Spinning away. And you see the playmaking ability of Jamari Thrash instead. His third field goal of the night. Plummer goes back to the air. And Chris Bell pinballs his way into the red zone and inside the 10 yard line. Now Coleman in motion. Plummer in zone. Caught for a touchdown. Great Dickens. Peach Bowl Incorporated CEO Gary Stoken, amongst others. Louisville throwing and completing. It's Kevin Cole. Until now. Thrash. Inside the 35 of Georgia Tech. A staple of these Jeff Brom offenses. Downfield. Open receiver. Touchdown. Jamari Thrash. Louisville takes the lead. Sit to him and put all the pressure on Louisville's defense. Third down. Kings will run for it. Gets a block up field and uses the legs for a first down. Of your offense. King keeps it. And a big gainer across the 30-yard line. King on the move again. Finds Rutherford. Ball is out. Is it a catch? To the air. King hit to the block side. The ball is out. Louisville picks it up. And off Jawar Jordan. Breaks a tackle. Still going. No one's going to catch him. And no flags. 74 yards for a touchdown. Jawar Jordan. King looking for his tight end sight. They're incomplete. A field goal, that is, prior to today at the collegiate level. And this one from 38 is good. It is a two-score game. Brought back at Louisville. What a boring pitch. Still competing. That That's what it's all about. Is Eric Singleton. Full display there. Back of the end zone. Singleton brings it in for his first career touchdown. Smith goes wide. Fade. Incomplete intended for Janelle. Stewart. Stewart kicks this one. Bouncing ball. Louisville says they have it. They do. Mark Thornton made it a 17-7 game. Brown's going to take it out from the end zone. And it's a good decision. Barry on Brown. Well, now how's that Kentucky fan feeling? Mighty good. Getting to the outside, I think, helps this rushing offense. First offensive play of the second half for Kentucky. Wide open. And Cummings still going down to the 20-yard line. Leary looking for Davis in the end zone. Touchdown, Kentucky. Jordan hits the seam and a null ball came out. Ball came out at the end just as he was spinning for extra yardage. There is a fight for it. What a great effort by J.J. Weaver from Kentucky in pursuit. Once Jordan got into the second level, it Kentucky was comes out with it. And look who has it. Tremendous pursuit and effort. He's able to sort of rip that out with his right arm. Jordan puts it on the floor, and that is a massive turnover for this Kentucky defense. What? This year, the pitch. Davis, got to get it, and he does.
and around Brown. Gets the block. Cuts up inside the 30 and tiptoes his way for more. This to tie the game from 46. And he does so. Third and three. Plummer trying to extend the play and look at an option. May have to run it here on third and three. Ball came out. The ball came out. And it's J.J. Weaver again. With another huge takeaway. Here's Jackson. Plummer doesn't do a good job with ball security, tucking the ball away. And, it, you know, the football takes crazy bounces. You think that thing was going to go out of bounds, but it didn't. It's Davis trying to get out of the backfield. Davis upfield inside the 10 into the end zone. How about these cats? Plummer goes underneath, and that's down to the 21 yard line as he connects. Plummer throws complete to Lee Ray Davis looking for something. Ray Davis getting loose. Second and ten for Leary. What a great throw in into the hands of Brown. And they are in range for a chance to win it. Ray Davis. Here goes Ray. Say goodbye to Ray. Into the end zone. And the Cats are in control. His dream season for Louisville. It comes down to this. He's going to loft it to the end zone. That ball is intercepted. That is Jordan Lovett to put a cap on it. Five, three first downs tonight. Two more by penalty. Here is King. He's going to flip it down the field. It's caught. Wide open and making the grab is Dominic Blaylock for the Yellow Jacket first down. And King, King will keep it this time. He's trying to circle to the far side inside the 10 and shoved out of bounds by James Williams, the safety. Defensive side of the ball for Miami. Third and goal. King to throw with time. Now we'll tuck at the five. Dives. And it is a Georgia Tech touchdown for Haynes King. And Van Dyke to load again. Shoots it downfield and intercepted. It is picked off by Harvey. Trying to find some room at the 40, and Amari Harvey to the far side at the 35. And Georgia Tech will start first and 10 at Miami's 25-yard line on Van Dyke. Second interception of the night. The flat and sinking, but Van Dyke puts the ball in harm's way. Rutherford hands the, in motion. Now here's Haynes breaking free, and he'll crack the 10. It'll be first and goal at Miami's 9 on the best run of the night for Jamal Haynes. 75 seconds to go. Hands the ball to Haynes. He keeps fighting and drives to the end zone. Second and third effort. Get the touchdown for Jamal Haynes. In the final half minute of the third. Van Dyke to throw on second down. From the pocket. Sailing for Restrepo in stride. Big play. Downfield to Xavier Restrepo. Looks. Oh, it's intercepted. It's picked off again. This is Jalen King, and it's a foot race with Tyler Van Dyke, and he'll be knocked out of bounds. Here's King. Or no, it's not King. They have gone to the backup, Zach Pyron. I think it'll have a big impact on how Van Dyke finishes this football game. Second and six. Van Dyke going to sail it deep, looking for Young, caught it. Colby Young inside the 10, dives, scores. Touchdown, Miami. Parrish, and he will score. Got hit by Brooks at the one and then just leveraged his way into the end zone. And Henry Parrish Jr. has got his fourth rushing score of the year. The secondary pressure. It's Scyther, the tight end in motion. Here's King with the pressure coming. He's trying to sail it. What a catch by the rookie Singleton for the first down at the 39-yard line. Prove to us that you can make us pay. Kings bring three here. King will throw. Intercepted. James Williams 
working back across field into Georgia Tech territory. And he will be knocked out of bounds inside the 20. Borgales to give Miami the lead from 39 yards. Middle of the field. Kick is perfect. And the Canes are in front with 6.23 to go. King from an empty set on first down. Trying to elude the rush, and he's going to be sacked. Reuben Bain Jr. And Miami got to try and manage the final two minutes. Here is Cheney. And will that be enough for the first down? It's close. We'll see how they spot the football. It is enough for the first down. So there'll be stuff to learn, but they're also. Five. After further review, the runner was stopped short of the line of the game. The ball be placed at the 33 and a half yard line. It'll be third down and a half yard to go. Shotgun set here for Van Dyke. They're going to hand the ball to Cheney. There's the first down. Van Dyke. Cheney again. He'll reach the 30. Georgia Tech's out of timeouts with 72 seconds to go. Braylon Oliver, the Minnesota transfer, the stop for Brent Key's defense. Before he said, just yeah, take a good. knee. Like yeah. you should not be handing this football off. Right. I don't know what Miami is doing. That's it. And here's Cheney. The straight ahead tackled and the ball popped out. He's got to read the clock. I mean, it would read the card. I mean, to and me, Georgia Tech has it with 26 seconds left. Kyle Kennard comes up with the fumble. You should not be running the football. I mean, it, it is. It, you should be taking a knee. As soon as you got that first down, they used that last time out. As long as you milk it all the way down, you don't need to be doing this, and you certainly don't need to be. Fighting for extra yards. The ruling on the field stands. First down, Georgia Tech. So with 26 seconds left, Miami commits its fourth turnover of the night on the fumble by Cheney. It's way down the field. Three to the field for King. Up in the pocket, going to loop it down the field, and it is caught. And that's Rutherford, who hangs on to it in Miami territory. And you got to get up and clock it. The cleats have got to be in the ground as soon as the whistle, as soon as they wind it, you got to clock it. Here's King. He will clock it. Four seconds come off the clock with the receivers to the top of the screen. Here's King from the pocket. Flush to his right with six, five. Going to loop it downfield. And ball is caught. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. With one second to go in the ball game, Christian Leary hauls it in. I mean, I'm going to say it. It needs to be said. That's one of the biggest coaching mistakes at this level that I have ever seen in my lifetime. Lineup's going to the 30. Excuse me. Plummer off play action. He'll take a shot deep downfield. He wants six and zone. I think he caught it. And it is a touchdown for the Cardinals. All of those things, and then you get a tremendous amount of reps. You just got here. He can still do this. The ball comes out. And Louisville looks to have it. They do. So NC State turns it over. And like that, momentum now belongs to the visitors from Derby City. Rash has been quiet today. Coleman in motion. Here's the trickeration. It comes back to Plummer. Throws it to Coleman. And he's navigating through a tight window. Still going. Mm. And he gets it to about the 30-yard line. Travelstead to tie the game. And he does. Even at 10. Quarter tied at 10. Noonkester, who's a weapon in the kick game, will punt it away. Coleman from the 30. Running laterally. He's got the 45 midfield. Great and tripped up by the punter, Noonkester. Turner goes wide. They drop a thrash. Gets to the outside. 
A first down and more. Jamari Thrash. Just his second catch of the game. First and goal Thrash, the Georgia State transfer. Plummer. Under pressure to the end zone. And that's intercepted. Louisville gives it right back. Plummer airs it down the sideline. And caught by Bell. First down, they take the shot downfield. Yeah, this will be about a 53-yarder. It's got enough leg. And Travelstead hits it. Career-long field goal for Brock Travelstead. And Louisville leaves. Cardinals with a win would go to 3-0 in the ACC. Since joining this conference, they've never been 3-0 in ACC play. Ray's a dangerous return man. And brings it out close to the 40-yard line for NC State. Transfer at NC State. Ball in his hands. Team down three. Armstrong is hit. Throws it up in the air. It's intercepted. Quincy Riley's got it. And Louisville a few kneel downs away from getting out of Carter Finley with a big ACC road win. Claiborne now checks in on first down. Claiborne with room to run. Breaks it to the open field. He's going to go. A touchdown. 42 yards for Claiborne. And Wake Forest takes the lead with 3.02 to go in this one. They are on third and 10 from his own 25. Time in the pocket. Over the middle. It is caught. His receiver, Dejon Reynolds, with a big first down there. Converted that one. And the crowd getting loud again for those that say that this place doesn't have passion. That's not the case. Bartholomew with a catch down to the 43-yard line. It'll be with his skill set. Second and two. Veyer hands it off to Flemister. Dancing in the backfield. Breaks into the second level. Picks up the first down as he's down at the 35-yard line. An eight-yard gain. Crowd amping up again. Bayer all day to throw. Launches one to the sidelines. Caught by Means for another first down. Crowd worried a bit. Pressure coming. Bayer launches one to the end zone. It's caught for a touchdown. 22 yards to Bob Means. The vertical threat. They talk about his center of gravity. They talk about how he takes the top off. You witnessed it right there. 19 to go, first and 10 from the 37 yard line. Marucci flings one down the field. It's caught by Banks inside the 40 yard line. Jamal Banks, what a catch there. In the backfield, the third running back for Wake Forest. Marucci launches one. It's picked off. MJ Devonshire. But a flag on the play. There's a man down as well. The result of the play is an interception. After the play was over, on sportsmanlike conduct, Pittsburgh number three pulling an opponent off the pile. That penalty is enforced half the distance to the goal. Also after the play, Unsportsmanlike conduct, Pittsburgh number three, his second of the game. That penalty will also be enforced half the distance to the goal, and number three is ejected. And that is Donovan McMillan who has been ejected. Wait, but just a great job in coverage right there, understanding Jamal Banks' ability and how he goes up and makes acrobatic catches, but great job to see in the football the whole entire time right there to come up with a huge... Keeps it. He's got the first down. Slides. Oh, wait. Wait a second. He may have started to slide short of the first down. From where he slid. Let's take a look. Field, as the runner was short of the line to gain, it's fourth down. How close he was. So where does he begin his slide? Ooh. 
see, that's the trick, right? It's it all it's always about where do you initially yeah. start to pull up yeah. and where that football is. Yeah. Right, you want to keep the clock going, and it's right there but on the sideline. But line. he had room still. Yeah, he could have done it. He could have kept going for a little bit. And a bad punt here, out of bounds. Morin takes it near midfield. Third and eleven. Twenty-eight seconds to go in the game. Pressure coming. Marucci flushed out of the pocket, being chased. Throws an ill-advised pass, but it's complete at the 40-yard line to Keyshawn Williams. He's going to be just shy of the first down marker, though. At the very least, with 20 seconds to go. Williams in motion. Fourth down. Marucci. He's got Keyshawn Williams for the first down, and then some cutting across the field, taken down at the 15-yard line. A huge first down. Stop the clock, they'll have to spike it here quickly, and they do. 12 seconds left on the clock, and Wake Forest is in field goal range. From the 15-yard line, Marucci over the middle, it's caught, touchdown! Cameron Height! With the touchdown, Wake Forest takes the lead, 15 yards, and Marucci just a few seconds away from being a legend on homecoming week. Unbelievable job of surveying the field, but I love that he goes to the big tight end Cameron Height right here. So Denenberg comes on for a 36-yard field goal. He's perfect inside 37 on the season. And this kick is up and good. Tomlin goes wide, low snap. Castellano stands in the pocket. He'll roll the show. Ball is out. On the hit by Barron. Syracuse picks it up. Field position, they're better than their own 45, and they don't have any points. Del Rio Wilson on the slant, finds Hatcher. He has it taken away by Elijah Jones. Second pick of the game by Jones, who just took Hatcher's lunch money. About two plays early. This is a fake. And they get the first down. Cam Dottie. There's the blitz. Castellanos gets to the outside, turns the corner, does it with his legs to move. Castellanos will run. Looking for the angle. He's got it. Touchdown, Boston College. There's orange tape. One timeout. Over the middle. It's tapped down. It's picked. Go up the middle, into the end zone, and a touchdown. Here they do a good job defending the jet sweep to him. Column does not have a catch tonight, and Mays in trouble, and he gets toppled by a group of white shirts led by Charmier Carter. 45-yarder for Betridge, closing second, third quarter, 7 of 8 on the season. Betridge to tie us up, but he's done it. The first drive of the third quarter. May avoids the pressure. Just a little touch pass. 20-yard line. First down and more. Hampton down near the 10. North Carolina's in front. Second down, Virginia. Keep you guessing. I bet you Trevor knows. We know we got a three-point game, that's for sure. What a pass! Musket just threading that one in there to Malik Washington. Musket out of the pocket, being chased. Got rid of it, Washington to the five. Washington still going to the end zone and in for the Cavaliers' touchdown. Four of six on third down in the second half. Hollins following his blockers. Hollins, the ball came out at the very end. Goes through the end zone. Hollins was right at the goal line. There's a fumble from the field play through the end zone. 
It was Armani Chapman. And now May, with the momentum, hits a man at midfield. The pass complete. What a call by Chip Lindsay to throw it deep. They want to toss it again. Over the middle and caught the 30. And inside the 20 for Tez Walker. They're going to run it and come up short. Well short. No gain on the play. May just barely got it away. And the ball is caught. Intercepted James Jackson for Virginia at the 42. He will hear if he can get rid of it. In the coverage, intercepted. That's Aiden White, the first team all conference quarterback. So just when you started to see the maturity and maybe the growth, you like what he gives you, but you just got to clean up the mistakes. Armstrong cannot find an escape route. Excellent job by the defense for four, just 14 yards. Quarterback draw. He's been dangerous with his feet. And he moves the chains of a player for a long, long time. They give to Pace. Charges to midfield. 44 yards on the ground to team high. On second down. Over the middle. And complete. And that's what you like. Wood. That's what you like. You see him go through his progression. There's a right to left or left to right. There he went through it. You could clearly see it. Calandria finds a wide open fields. Using that big 6 4 frame to bully to the 25 yard line. A first down for Virginia. It's clearly inside. Three man rush. Washington, the catch. The yards after catch. Close to a first down. It brings up third and short. On third and short. Collins hit by Jalen Scott. And he does not get there. It's fourth down. Well, I'd like to see Calandria. Washington in motion. Calandria sprints right. Throws. Washington the catch. Fighting for the extra yards. First and goal. Wahoo. Smart play call. Hollins goes wide. Calandria to Washington. Touchdown, Virginia. They're a two-point conversion from tying the game. Now a penalty marker. Is this rough in the passer? The ruling on the field is a touchdown. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct, number 51 on the offense. 50-yard trailing will be enforced on the extra floor. So now it's huge. Yeah, that that, that's huge. huge. You can't do that. Let's see if we can a little hit, but this you can't do that. Working against Gavin Van the entire game, you cannot do that. We're essentially prevent here. Calandria looking. Throws it up for Fields, and he came down with it. More flags and, after and the And it's going to be another penalty on Calandria for taking his helmet off, putting his hands on his hips. And he had it off. He definitely had it off. He's trying to tell the official he didn't take it off. The two-point attempt was good. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct on number 10 on the offense. That 15-yard penalty will be carried over and administered on the kickoff. I want to bring in our rules analyst, Matt Austin. Julian Gray. From just inside his 20. He's got the 30. He'll cut it up the far side. Into Virginia territory. The top kick return man in the ACC to lead the Wolfpack to a win. He's got the pen last here in regulation. He'll step up. And tumbles to the 40-yard line. 
19 seconds. Armstrong will run. He's got the 35. He slides. They mark him where he started the slide. That's the 32. Nine seconds. Wolfpack have a timeout. Another quarterback run. Using the block from Mims to the 30. Clock stops with five seconds. NC State with his helmet off. Puts NC State in a short field. You get the return by Gray. And here we are with three seconds left. 48 yards for the win. Kick is blocked. Flag is down. I don't know if they went over the top of the snapper. They have a, a second Personal opportunity. Personal foul. Leaping. Number seven on the defense. 15-yard penalty. Replay the down. James Jackson right in the middle. He's got to go straight up. He cannot come down. You cannot go over the back of a player to get there. The Wolfpack win it. The horn. Like they're going to pressure from the field. You either drop or you throw it, see it from the boundary. Pressure, Fancher, cinching, passes, intercepted. And there's the big. Drones takes off, hit hard. Get quick three and outs from Marshall. Three first downs on this possession. The Hokies have it in drones. He'll roll out the pocket, and there he goes. Touchdown, Jack. Slot to the top. Bottled up. In the second half, on third down, Fancher going to try to step ahead, and he does. He slides down short of the line to gain. And we've got second down and seven. Drones feeling that pressure right in front of his grill. He'll try to make something out of nothing, and he will. It's getting loud in Huntington on fourth down, and they'll snap it. Drones, got to get rid of it. Has a man caught, first down, Hokies. In of 19 on fourth and three. From the 45, Drones quickly into plus territory. Gosnell will pick up the first inside. Thomas in at running back. 90 seconds to go. Drones again finds his tight end. Stopped at the 30. The herd will rush four. Drones across the middle and incomplete. Moden again broke it up. So second and ten for Griffiths. All time to throw. Has a receiver wide open. Wake Forest. And that's Morin. And he's brought down at the three-yard line. And the game continues for Griffiths. Picks, rubs, hang, bang. Griffiths, time. Has room to run. Griffiths, touchdown. the college football season. Matt Berry, Dan Mullen, Harry Lyles with you. Wake forced up 21-14. Third and five for Griffiths. Just threw his first incomplete pass and he's going to go right up the back. He's going to helicopter again and the ball comes out. Both teams heavily penalized in their game a week ago, but so far pretty clean here tonight. Loftus lofts it. Touchdown! Jordan Moore! Both teams heavily penalized in their game a week ago, but so far pretty clean here tonight. Loftus lofts it. Touchdown! Jordan Moore! Griffiths. Time. Soft over the middle, and that's going to be a first down. Caught by Cameron Height. Hits the spot of the ball, moves the chain. Trey Freeman makes his 11th tackle of the evening. Griffiths, it's intercepted! The pass was tipped, and Ryan Smith opened his hands, looked, and there was a football in it. Down to a minute, opposite side of the quad, thrown, and it's caught. And that's gonna be a flag on top of the reception. 
Jones threw down Hagens after he had the first down yardage, and that's going to be 15 on top. Just a mental error you cannot make it. Smart play, you get into the quad, so you get somebody singled up, so you can see if you just have the one-on-one -on -one out there to your receiver, and Jones, you just can't do that. Snap, clean, kick, up. Duke wins. Here's Isaiah Williams. He's going to throw it wide open. End zone. Touchdown, Pat Bryant. Williams in motion. Love to Paddock's left. Paddock rolls, throws. Two-point try is good. Tip Ryman. Timeout to an official's review. Illinois still three timeouts. Bryant. Big gap up the middle, touchdown Northwestern. Bowl eligible for the second straight year, and for the first time, they would be bowl eligible in back-to-back -back years in over a decade. Wiltshire has had some good returns tonight, but not this time, that ball's out again, oh and goodness. it's scooped up by the Wildcats, and this is going to be a touchdown. They need a bowl game. Paddock pointing downfield, has a man wide open, that is Casey Washington. Washington cuts back. It's a foot race inside the 10. Washington down near the two. Get six here. Panic. Puffs. Throws. Enzo. Touchdown, Casey Washington. Caleb Tiernan picks him up. Remember the side of the line they attacked there without Keith Randolph. Deep ball downfield. It's Kurtz. And it's going to be intercepted. Washington one on one at the bottom of your screen as well. Teams have been pretty good on third down tonight. Third and six for Paddock. Off his back foot throws, and it's tipped. And was that caught by Mueller off the pick? One's blocked more kicks than Illinois. On the way from Olsen, it's low, and that is going to sneak through and good. <laughs> on second down, Paddock throws, and it's Washington. Washington inside the 45. Casey Washington down the sideline. Washington near the pylon. And he is in. Touchdown, Illinois. Unbelievable. The sixth penalty on Indiana moves the chains. First down. The paddock going deep again. Williams breaks out of there. Isaiah Williams. They, although they got beat, that gave them a lot of confidence. And that is intercepted. The start of the fourth quarter. It's a first down for the Illini. Here's Love hitting a save. Love in for a touchdown. Second and goal for Sorsby. Sorsby pulls it out of there. And looking to run. And another physical, powerful run. They get an eight-point game from 21 yards out for Griffin. And the Illini do extend their lead. Down in a two-point conversion to tie the game. Sorsby back across the middle and throws it in for a touchdown. No flags. Got a bunch down to the bottom side. Uh, now he's motioned out of it. Might be. Paddock running away. Casey in pursuit. Paddock to Williams. The legend grows. To Williams. Zor, thank you. Play action. Deacon Hill in trouble. Sacks. And he lost the ball. Fumble of the 10 yard line. Minnesota has it. 33 as well. And this one from 28 yards out. Minnesota now only from 31 yards out. For the first time, Minnesota has the lead. Mark Crawford steps up to the five. High end over end punt. Dejean not going to touch it until now. Little spin down the sideline. Got some space. Here he comes. Cooper Dejean cuts it back. 25. He's got a chance. He scores. Reviewing the play. The returner waved his left hand, which is an invalid fair catch signal. Therefore, by rule, the ball became dead upon recovery. The ball be placed at the 46-yard line 
Clock operator, please reset the game clock to one minute, 33 seconds. So they took a long, long look at that. They brought the play back. Iowa's offense could have got, get it done, and now clock ticking away. Seven, six left. Couple of firsts here. Rain, wet balls, and laceless balls to be ready. Final play of this third quarter. It's Littleton pushing the pile in. Third. Now House is going to send it away. He did have an onside kick to start the second half. And this will be returned by Canary Wiltshire. And Wiltshire finds a seam down the side and across the 40. Did it at MSU this year. The kick from House. He's got it. Got to make a first down or two. They're going to go to the air. Taking the shot, Altmaier. Wow! Oh, it's caught. Casey Washington snares it. First down. <laughs> Caleb Griffin on the road for the win. Griffin is good. <laughs> Michael O'Shaughnessy dropped it. O'Shaughnessy dropped it. It's loose in the end zone. It's recovered by Rutgers. Wimson over the middle. That's caught by Isaiah Washington. First down to the 46. Right. No more pressure. And Manungai, that opens up. Manungai still going inside the 40. Spun down. Wonder if this is four down territory right now for Rutgers. A big point. First down run. There are holes everywhere in zones. Offense. But no guy running over Spartans and now will go down inside the five. If you kick the field goal, though, you're eight point game. It's open. Should have thrown it. Towards the back pylon. And that's Washington. Touchdown. Touchdown. Rutgers. For two to make this a three point game. Wimson throws quickly. That's great. Dremel has it. Two point try is good. It's a three-point zone two in conference play. Rutgers, meanwhile, looking for win number two. And big time. And that's it's recovered by Rutgers. Henry never went after the ball. That's a huge mistake. That ball's in the air. You've got to go get it. They're not moving. It's a run. It's been no good. Wimsett now will take a knee. That's it. And that'll do it. Bryant now under center. Two Porter pushes his way across the goal line for the Wildcat yeah. touchdown. It's about all kinds of experience and inexperience with this 2023 Minnesota football team. Deep pass. Eight catches in this game. Alone against Minnesota. Again going Kurt's way. How about that? Dropping it in the bread basket. Northwestern just moving down the field. Bryant good footwork. How about Kurtz? Touchdown. What a night. On third and two. Two Taylor tries to break it on the outside. How about a stop? Xander. <laughs> Mark Crawford. Minnesota with a chance. Oh, wow. Now, why would they do that here for Northwestern? Bryant looking towards his right. That time, they can no gain on that play. Second and ten. And the clock's still moving. Bryant gets wrapped up, but a flag's going to come. That's going to be a face mask. Pocket collapsing on Bryant, but he gets rid of it. Another first down is not on Northwestern side. Here comes Minnesota with some pressure. Bryant got to get out of bounds for the Wildcats. Horton makes the play. Wow. Bryant, nearly taken down, finds Henning. Seconds keep going again. Northwestern doesn't have any timeouts. You hear P.J. Fleck telling the officials to watch the rub routes. Bryant, coin and zone pass is broken up. Cam Johnson, the intended receiver. Trayvon Jones is there. Northwestern's got to find the end zone to extend this game. Bryant pump fake into the end zone. It's caught. A.J. Henning keeps the Wildcats' hopes alive. 
Calcmanis into the air while hanging on to the play. Williams stays in. Calcmanis off the hands of Spanford, nearly intercepted. And Minnesota gets three points here in overtime. Result of this game. Northwestern wins the game with a touchdown. Rolling out, boot action. Bryant all alone. Northwestern, the catch is made. Matt Cherry with the game winner. Down 21. Down three scores. And the Cats comeback is complete. To his right, does it very often. They're down at 11. Purdy. He's got fleeks and fleeks inside Iowa territory. Stumbling around makes three men miss. And eventually is down at the 30-yard line of the Hawkeyes. He's got the wind at his back. It's a good snap, good hole. Kick is on its way. It's got the length, and it's good, and we're tied up at 10. Purdy, short drop out of the gun, will keep it himself. Johnson was there to block for him. And Purdy's got a first down inside Iowa territory. Schulte makes the tackle. Doney, the tight end at the bottom of your screen. Purdy's in trouble, gets away. He can run for it. He fumbled it again. It's loose on the field. Good snap, good hold. Kick is on its way, and it's no good. He's pulling it to the left. Williams in the backfield. Hill looking to throw. Hill going long. It's intercepted. Tommy Hill picks it out of the air. Flags come in as he goes out of bounds. Receivers to the top, two to the bottom. Pressure's coming. Picked up by Nebraska. Intercepted! Herkett will rumble out of bounds. They hand it off to Williams. Williams inside the 30. Breaks a tackle inside the 25. Good snap. Good hold. Kick is on its way. It is good! High formation. Patterson still the tailback. Play action, rolling, a stringer, touchdown Iowa! It's behind him, he's converted third down twice on this drive. And he'll have a chance on four, chase to the perimeter. And it looks like this is going to come down to a mark. Quarterback sneak, Sullivan, no surge, didn't get there! Northwestern playing for the return, another poor punt by Taylor. And Henning... Going to give Northwestern excellent field position. Nice spin move at the end. Sullivan lets it go. End zone. Touchdown, Camp Johnson. Is a timeout yet? Iowa needs about 25 yards here to get into his range. Nice pocket there for Hill. Throws his best pass of the day. Down inside the 40. Stevens' attempt is up. Corum dancing. Corum breaks a tackle to the end zone. Blake the great touchdown Wolverines. Edwards, they pitch it to him. Edwards wants to throw it. Wide open. He's got his man. Loveland. But from 50, this one from 38. And good. Play fake. McCord winds up. Sideline. Back shoulder. Puts the biscuit. McCord will let it fly over the middle, caught Harrison, touchdown, Maserati Mar. And they'll give it to Edwards, and Edwards will spin forward and pick up a first down as he gets. Corum again, outside, Corum looking for the first down, stays inbound, picks it up. Clean snap, good hole, got it away, and good. McCord looking over the middle, caught at the 40. A 22 yard game. McCord looks, guns it, underneath, caught. Oh, drop by Fleming, picked up by Ibuka. The wide receiver at the top of your screen. McCord looks, fires, intercepted. The Boilers last week off first down. Cord over the middle, drops it off. Train him with space, breaks the tackle. Still on the move and lowers it short. Clean snap, good hole, got it up and good. State first down and ten at the 38. 
And they'll run it big lane, Nick Singleton. Nick, twins at the top of your screen. They'll give it to Singleton, another huge hole. Singleton, another first down, and he'll get... Got it away, and good. McCord looking over the middle. And Tate. Here's McCord under pressure. McCord lost it. Loose ball. Picked up. Curtis Jacobs down the sideline. Touchdown, Nittany Lions. 59 yards. Holding. Defense. Number four. It'll be a 10 yard penalty. Automatic first down. The 16. Here's McCord underneath. Squeezed it in, and it's a reception. And they'll give it to him. Williams trying to get in, and dives at the end. Touchdown, Buckeye. Allen, play fake. Rolls out, crosses body, puts it on the money. Theo Johnson gets his shoulder square. And Theo Johnson. And it's good. McCord with time. McCord now sacked. Inside the five. So a supreme belief in their defense. McCord over the middle. Caught up high. Maserati. McCord again to throw it. Over the middle. Caught by Stover at the 10. Williams. And Williams met in the backfield and dropped for a loss. And goal. Quick snap. They swing it out wide. Tate. And he won't get there. Tim punting out of his own end zone. Ballard, ready to return, lets it take a bounce, and it bounces laterally. I can touch Ohio State. And they say it touched Ohio State's Julian Fleming. There's Lorenzo Styles Jr., transfer from Notre Dame, came over with his brother Sonny Styles when he committed, and he's trying to block. He doesn't get the signal. That's the touch right there off his right leg. Ballard, play fake, and trouble. Tuivolo is there, and a sack. McCord out of his end zone, underneath, on the crossing route. Marvin Harrison Jr., and he'll go out of receiver. Eight catches, 126 yards for Harrison over the middle. Stover again. Got it away. And good. Aller looking, throws, and deflected. At the 19, McCord. Over the middle, Harrison Jr. again, down the sideline, Maserati Mar. Fourth and 30, and a sack. And this one, no good. Eyes for Penn State. Over the middle, and this time, Cephas. All day long. Second down and 10, Aller moving around. Cross his body, caught at the 20-yard line. Great. Aller in trouble. Rolls out. Buys time. Fires. Caught. Caden Saunders. That's a touchdown for Penn State. A quick look at the catch here to see if he hauled it in, and it looked like he controlled it. He was down with control. Body part inbounds. And Throws it out wide. Lambert Smith in the end zone. Knocked away and he here's the onside. Takes a big bounce and recovered by Ohio State. Mockaby the tailback. Mockaby up the middle and Mockaby did not get there. And Gilliam cuts right and finds a whole lot of space. First down across the 20. That's down to the bottom of your screen. King floats it looking for Delano dangerously thrown. That is picked off by Thieneman. Two timeouts left down four. Carr taking a shot downfield. And that is caught in stride. Can't get a first down at the one. It's Maccabee. Cuts. Scores. Touchdown, Purdue. Key play broke your right. And energy here at Ross A. Stadium. King steps up. He'll throw it open. That's caught Delano. The veteran. A play that matters so much in this game. Look at the other way, and that's caught. Been the fitting theme for Mikey Keene's success. A 
under two to play. The clock will stop on a first down as it will here. King again, it's Gill. Beat a Big Ten team in 2010. King taking a shot. It's Brooks. It's in the end zone. Touchdown, Fresno State. Card throws open. That's caught. Nope. Trying to get the edge. Curtis and is brought down. Seen in motion. Tracy to cards right. On fourth and short. It's tipped in. It's incomplete. Keep an eye on Stover and how many reps he gets today. He's been battling a knee injury. Floyd to the end zone. Pass is caught. Touchdown, Ohio State. Pool. He said, now I know why people like going to the game so much. <laughs> on first down, Ture will take him down. Wims it. Looking to throw. He's lofting it near sideline. He's got Dremel and he overthrows him. Yeah, the court will just hand it off, and Henderson is pirouetted to the first down and doesn't get the first down. They could go. The court on third down, looking to throw to the far side. Harrison, he can't make the catch. It was a little underthrown. Wims it so far 0 for 4. It's a total opposite. Now he runs. This is what Ross talked about before, and he's got a first down out of bounds. Wims it will keep it himself and wins it barrels forward. Oh, he fumbled it. He fumbled it and Manungai picks it up. This was a play that was set. Manungai into the open field and Manungai inside the 15. And Play clock down to two. Good snap, good hold. Kick is on its way, and it is good. Yardage after the catch. Burko is on the punt, and he's going to pull out a trick play of himself. Can he get to the first down? A flag is in. He's nailed out of bounds. Under six minutes to play, first half. Manungai again. Manungai inside the 20. Makes a man miss to his left and is down to the 16-yard line. Because he's a pass rusher, because Manungai runs so much, Eichenberg's able to stop him. Wins it. Out of the backfield, Dremel bounces his way right to the line of scrimmage. He might have got a hand. Good snap, good hold. Kick is on its way, and the kick is good. Set it right, Tom. Just sat right down in it. And there, the ball is intercepted. Ture, eyes are wide, out of bounds, inside Ohio State territory. On third down, pressure's coming again. Pass is zipped, and it's complete. Jackson. Patel's long is 51. Pass completes. Dremel down to the 15. Wins it to throw on first down. Steps up in the pocket. Dumps it off underneath. Langan. And he's inside the 10 to the 5. Dives forward to the 2. Trying to give Rutgers the lead as we wind down the first half. On third down. And Patel's field goal attempt is good. Wins it to throw. Has time. Lofts it left side. Pass is incomplete. And there's a flag. These guys are getting better and better at actually drawing those pass interference penalties. Here's Manungai again. Manungai over 100 yards. Manungai inside the 40. Rutgers player to have 500-yard rushing games in a season since 2012. And he's going to get some more. And he's tripped up from behind. Close to 10 as well. Wims it. Steps up. Now we will throw it for Manungai. And it's incomplete. Oh, it's tipped. It's intercepted. It was tipped into the hands of Hancock. And Hancock along the near sideline. He's got a blocker. One man to beat. Flags come flying in. And Hancock is into the end zone. Five. McCord looking to throw. Throws to his right. Passes complete to his right. Matt Plundo, by the way, is our director. Bill Thayer is our producer today. Here's Henderson. Henderson makes a man miss. He's inside the 20 along the sideline. Girds the H-back, number 49. They hand it to Henderson, who runs the opposite way. He shoves one blocker into the end zone. Wims it. Throws. Pass to Dremel. He breaks one tackle, now another. Stumbles inside the 30. And he's taken down inside the 20-yard line. Eichenberg. First down inside the 20. Wims it off the play fix, sets up in the pocket, goes toward the end zone, caught! That looks like simultaneous possession. Harrison. The court underneath to Henderson. Henderson trying to get to the sticks at the 35, he does! And he blasts right on past an inside Rutgers territory. Cuts back to the right. He could go along the numbers and he's tripped up. 
Melton tracked him down. Man-to-man -man coverage will bring pressure off the edge. And they're going to go toward Harris, and he turns, makes the catch. But it's a first down for the Scarlet Knights. Wimsett will keep it himself. And Wimsett's inside the 15. He fumbled the football, but Dremel fell on top of it. And it's third down and goal. Wimsett pumps a few times, throws to the back of the end zone. And it's caught, but I think he's out of bounds. Incomplete. Washington in motion. Wimsett looks to his right. Nothing there. Spins away. He's taken down. State fans, they're, they're kind of not used to it. It's a little bit uncomfortable to win with the D. On second down, it's Henderson. The D and Henderson. And Henderson into the open fields. And Henderson is spun down at the 43-yard line. Taking a look at Eichenberg as he comes off the sideline. Wimsett to throw. Lofts it to the near side. And it's incomplete. Third and goal. They go to the left. Harrison adjusts his body, makes the catch. It's his second touchdown of the day. Blake Lock at two. Lock. Time looking open. End zone caught. Touchdown. It's Pauling. And the toss goes to Anthony. Vinny Anthony. First down and more. Here comes Casey, and he got home. Luck, time, throws low. Nice catch made by Iacomelli. Spins his way, ball came out. It's on the ground. It's contested, and the Hoosiers believe they have it. More, and more deception rather than try to force feed him. Sorsby in trouble, and down he goes. That play to, to start to try to win this game. Aker got a nice block, and now finds some space. Are they trying to draw? No. Kick on the way. It is up, and it is good. On fourth down, lock, complete. Balls out in the hands of Sanguinetti, and he runs out of bounds at the 15-yard line. His players. So he understands where that good stuff is coming from. Seam shot and an interception in less than one. To Quindon Jackson. First down. It's got the distance and it is right down the middle. Oh, they're pitching one of the best games they've had in quite some time. Johnson rips a pass over the middle to Mikey Matthews. And on second and 15. Following the sack, Johnson responds. Baylor's been great in coverage all day. Again, it's Glover. He's got the first down. Play action here. Johnson rolls. Finds a crosser. Monty Parks. I'm snapping the ball with 15 on the play clock. There's the slant reaching out to make the catch. It's Mikey Matthews. The freshman gets walloped, but he's down to the 20 yard line. Quarterback run right up the middle. Thinking they're going to get the ball back and have a chance to win. Some pressure. High throw over the middle. It's intercepted. Picked off by Cole Bishop. Again, on third down and six now. And they'll stay with him. He's up the middle. Breaks free. He's got the first down. Kick of all time. He must like the right hatch. Whatever Utah has done with their aggression and the tight coverage has made the passing game completely go away. One the, the runner stepped out of bounds with one second on the clock. So there it is. Bring a penalty, one snap. Here comes an all-out blitz. It's hoisted towards the end zone, one-on-one. -on -one. to make this catch so they bring this pressure making Sawyer Robertson throw the ball sooner than he wants to but he gets great air on the ball and listen they did not call pass interference so it's not pass interference but Miles Battle was fighting with the receiver there Keytron Jackson at the end and the rest decided we're not going to make it about us and we're going to stay out of it and in the end at least to the Baylor fans they made it about them
Yep. Because this whole stadium believes that pass interference should have been called. He's leading rusher. The fake to Gordon. The slant caught by Leon Johnson. And using that big 6-5 frame to pull Cougars inside the 15. Make it 16. Second and 15, Bowman. And it's picked off by Heckard. Big third down and 12. Retzlaff completes to Epps. He's not going to get there. It'll be Here's the blitz. Picked up. Bowman's throw. Caught. Leon Johnson with a first down. Heck, not really allowed him to break off big runs. Bowman downfield. Owens pulls it away. Last year, I mean last week, now getting close to, to that number. Mahalski back in the slant to Owens. The red zone and had to come away with field goal. High snap. Ollie Gordon. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. Home into the air. Backpedaling. Floats it to Owens. The conversion is good. Possession, but you've got the ball. Take care of it now. Bowman to Nixon. Bulldozing forward for the first down. Ran over Eddie Heckard. Bowman downfield into coverage. It's caught. But uh, two tight ends. Gordon running weak side. Gets the edge. Touchdown, Ali Gordon. Number one rusher in college football. 141 yards, three touchdowns. The PAT is no good. To the air. A four-man rush. Now delayed pressure. Over the middle. He's got Hill. Not have a field goal of 50-plus in his career. Another blitz. Retzlaff rolling out. Wants Epps. He's got Epps. First down. Oh, might get you the first down. Retzlaff. Monk's knotted curtains of rain. Throws. Marion the diving catch. Inside the 35, nine seconds to go. Freeze him if he wants. Here's the snap, the hold, the kick. It is up. And good. Rex the tight end in motion. Here comes Robbins. Straight ahead, first down. Retzlaff will keep it, looking for the edge. Gets the edge. In for a score. In this game, every snap right now. Out of a two tight end set. Here is Gordon. Gordon cuts it back. Touchdown number four. 63 rushing yards in what has been a driving rain for most of the afternoon. On the end around, inside the 15 to the two tight ends. The give to Gordon. Changing direction. Catapults. Touchdown is the call. Bowman throws. Josiah Johnson won't get there. Epps motions. Retzlaff's throw. It's brought in by the tight end Rex. And then taken away by Oklahoma State. And that's the ball game. More shifty. Big hole opens up. Step arming down to the 20. Back to back carries. They go bunch formation. Oh. Dangerous throw. And then a big hit applied by McKee on the way. And it is good. Since he drops eight into coverage, finding a hole over the middle and a first down catch at the 20. Red Hawks. Gabbert can run if he wants to, and he's going to take off. It's a foot race to the pylon. Gabbert oh, gives oh, up the oh, body. Oh, Did he get in? No. no. Into the game at quarterback. They run the quick handoff and a touchdown for the Red Hawks. Untouched goes kept. This is chestnut checkers. You see a. Uh, Boy, he barely got that handoff. Yeah. Barely. Third quarter. Jones will throw near side. There's Henderson. 16 yards up past midfield. Tips right. Oh. Jones on a keeper. Picks up a great kick out block. And then he is hit hard by Ty Wise. Bernie. One thing they're not doing for the Bearhawks is 
third down run. run. Look at this by Jones. He throws the linebackers. He's in. 17 yards. And just as I'm talking about the big hands on the right side of the field, he sees the crossing route at the goal at the goal post, but keeps his eyes right for Matera to actually come from the 25-yard line. Up the middle, patient run, a little hole opens up, and now the power of Amos that we really haven't seen tonight. Miami rushes for home run shot. Receiver out there. Smith makes the catch. What a throw. What a catch. Brayton Smith. The game. Don't get away from your game plan. Stick with it. You're only down a few points. They go right, they back, go right to back to that direction. And Marshall makes the catch. On the play clock. Pressure. Buy some time. One-on-one -on -one matchup downfield. Again, a flag flies. This time, it's in. Gabber zips it over the middle. Caught at the Here. five. And it will be first and goal. This in motion. Gabbert looking for that throwback. The tight end knocked away. Good read. Look at here, look at here. And now a fake putt. Lots of room to run. Big tight first end. down. It's the tight end, Mateo. Oh my, what a gamble. Already in field goal range for Carter Brown. And off is to Ryan Montgomery. And man, that lower half strength just kept the legs moving. Ty Wise at. Davis leads the backfield. Pressure around Gabbard. He's going to take off. Room to run. 15-10. And Gabbard shoved out of bounds at the 8. First and goal, Miami. Puts some air on it. Looking for Wilkins. Comes back. Makes the catch. Was he in bounds? Yes. Touchdown, Joe Wilkins. Moments at night here at Nippert Stadium. Can Jones dial up another? Fires downfield. The pass is caught. Real close to a first down. Wiggins slot left. Looking his direction. Jones puts it up. Knocked away. Good pass break up by Dahl. But there is a he set. Ryan Montgomery in motion. It's a draw all the way by Jones as he submarines his way up to the two-yard line. Ty Wise this left. Draw by Jones. Henry Jones inside the five. And he is brought down. Salapek again here at Nippert Stadium. It comes down to this play. In the first overtime, Jones, patient, throws, intercepted. Miami has snapped the skid. Yeah, the trips are Manjack, Golden, and Brown, their top three receivers in that order. Looking that way into the end zone, got his man, and on cue. It's a touchdown for Houston to Matthew Golden. He's out of the end zone if you're Houston. Daniels trying to get into the end zone, throws that way, oh. and it is intercepted. Indeed it is. Daniels from the empty set, throwing the other way. Mm. On the slant, has a man. Falls out. And the Cougars have recovered. Line moved. Going to run it on first down. A lot of room up the middle. Mm. Making a man miss is Stacy Sneed. Will they just go quarterback keeper? They do. Smith lowers his shoulders. Touchdown! Smith throws it up. Has a man. Touchdown! New fullbacks and follow them right side. Indeed they do. Mm. Big hole and an easy touchdown for Dalen Alexander. Daniels hands it off straight up the gut. Touchdown! Down to one, they get the snap. Here's the run, mm. jumping it outside. For the two is Alexander. Oh. Snap is dropped, Smith able to pick it up and he's gonna run wow. to get to the corner of the end zone on a broken play. Smith for two to Golden. He's not able to haul it in and Rice wins the football game in double overtime. Looking to throw, and that one's picked off. Torrey Cox Jr. with the interception. On third and three, Rourke is looking to pass. Flushed out to his right. He's going to use his feet and pushed out in. Ohio on third and goal. Rourke scanning in the middle. Touchdown! Pull the gap. Yeah, that's what it needs right now is just a veteran player to step up and say, we got to get it together and play better. Here's one. Benjamin Bramer loaded roster for the blue. Rourke will keep it. Plenty of time. A rifle over the middle. He's got Walton. 
Throwing over the middle, completes again. Rourke, strong throw to the outside. What a throw on the money to Sam Wigless. Second and five. They move the pocket. Rourke keeps it himself. Will dive forward. Spedic's kick is up and good. Only the man in motion across the formation on second and ten. They're looking his direction. Now they throw the out route. 18-yard penalty. Beck on first down. He's got a man wide open down the sideline. Daniel Jackson stumbling out of bounds. Ball on the 18, first and 10. Beck looking. Enzo, touchdown! Underneath. First and 10. Beck, a bullet. And it's picked off! Safety, the defensive back. Brooklyn, you see him at the top of the screen. He's reading, reading, reading. And he breaks on the ball. Showed some waffle iron hands there. Big run. Trace John Ward finds an opening. Ward into Kansas territory. Finally tracked down from behind. And it went for 46. Howard finds his man. It's Ben Sinnott. Haven't called his name in a little while. Giddens again. And it's a first down. They stay trying to stem the tide here. Hand off for Giddens. And he surges ahead for the touchdown. Howard pulls it back and takes it in for the two-point conversion. Mendes ball game. On the six. Long return here by Kenny Logan. Facing a three-man front. Ballard with time. Time running out. Rolls to his left. Floats this ball into double coverage. Intercepted. But a turnover here. Gives the ball to K-State. Shy of midfield. Quick hitter Jace Brown into plus territory. On third and seven. Howard to pass. It's intercepted. Configuration. No more track. Probably a good thing. Better sight lines. Neal on the pitch play. First down and more. Two seasons at Minnesota. Came into the day third in the Big 12 in sacks. This is muffed. Punt. Kansas State going backward. And looked like he took his eyes off the ball for a second there. 31 yards with the interception. Howard, quick dart, complete to Brown, turns the corner, and is pushed out of bounds after crossing the 30-yard line. And take the lead. Howard keeps it. Howard to the end zone. Touchdown, Wildcats. Ocean. Neil the carry. Neil hurls over initial tackle, stays on his feet, and spins across the 45. For Neil. And now Ballard with time to pass. It is caught across the middle. No Klanderman's looking on. That's a beautiful look out of the option. 17-yard run, 18-yard pass. Ballard escapes. Ducks out to the sideline. Has another first down for the Jayhawks. Pressure coming. Pass to the end zone. It is intercepted. Push. Howard to keep it. Howard ran into his home man, nearly blew up the play. On second down, Giddens. He will get to the stick and be pushed across. Four lead changes in this game. Third down and seven. Howard to pass to the outside. Caught for the first down. Obviously a big call in the game. The key is firm control. That's what the rule book talks about. It looks like he gains firm control initially, but then that contact, that ball is moving. Now, slight movement doesn't mean loss of control, but again, that really, to me, feels like he doesn't have firm control at that point. After further review, the ruling on the field stands. Candace is not charged for timeout as we were paid prior to.
the 26. Will Howard winds up, delivers, and it's caught by Phillip Brooks. Turns it up, still running, dive, touchdown, K-State. See if he can find his rhythm. Murphy. And intercepted. This time, Parrish. He lost it. Howard steps up in the pocket, drops it off. He's got his man. Touchdown, Kansas State. The run game for the Longhorns. Brooks looking for the first down. And fumble. And a fumble. Does Kansas State have it again? Holy. Brooks was fighting for extra yards. Not down, ball clearly out. I believe that was Brendan Mott. Shifting. Will Howard in the gun. Hands it off. No. Play fake. Touchdown, Wildcats. Wow. Jace Brown. Clock at five. And they'll get it off. Murphy over the middle. Caught. First down and more. Be four yards away. And Texas will take the lead. Will Howard. Play fake. Howard. Dancing. Howard gets a block. Let's it go. Sideline throw. Brooks. Did he get a foot in? Howard. Runs it. Howard. No! He won't get it. It's away. Tennant. Oh, he missed it. Out of the gun. Howard, here comes a blitz. They pick it up. Howard underneath. Caught. First down inside the Texas 30. Way to take the lead. And it's good. Howard. Throws it over the middle, caught inside the 10 by Sinnott. Empty backfield. Howard looking. Howard scrambles. Howard lets it go. Incomplete. And Texas survives. Again, Jeff Levy, the play caller. Play action pass. Gabriel setting up, gets drilled as he launches it downfield into double coverage. And it's picked off. Intercepted by Dylan Smith. Bringing it back to the 35 for Oklahoma. To go. Trying to keep national title hopes alive. And there is Gordon breaking one. Past the 40. A stiff arm at the 30. And finally out of bounds at the 25. Only Gordon back in the game. And Gordon gets the carry. And he's dragged down short. And he moves the chain to the first down. Play fake again. Gabriel setting up, pass over the middle is caught, Anderson first down, he dropped what might have been a touchdown earlier in the game. And Gabriel makes him pay. And they run Tommy Walker, his first touch of the game, and he's into the end zone to give Oklahoma the lead. 23-yard Sooner touchdown. Yeah, but much better here in the second. Third and 11, obvious passing down. And it's caught by Presley, and he powers his way past the line to game. Rip it away. Long throw, caught by Owens, and he breaks a tackle. Stiff arming, and he can't stay in bounds. He steps up. Back, he's over 100 yards today. The leading rusher in the country gets a pitch here, and he's going to throw it, looking back to his quarterback. Now on the move, he lobs it. It hangs in the air forever, and it's intercepted by Billy Bowman. Bowman running it back past the 15. He's got some room past the 30. Quarterback to beat, and Bowman finally gets him out of bounds. The territory. At the 46, Bowman back to throw with time and to the sideline, and it's again Owens to the 30 and down. The 12th time since Mike Gundy took over as OSU coach. Gordon inside the 10, inside the 5, and fourth penalty on this drive by OU. Gordon ends up. Oklahoma State leads it. Ball on the ground on a bad snap to Gabriel year from Peyton Bowen this will be a 33 yard attempt from Alex Hale the kick is good on fourth down Gabriel on the run throwing Stoops juggled it caught it but he's short Oklahoma State's gonna take over on downs he 
He's a guy who's hit from 60 in practice. This one is on the way. Junior college, and now he's finishing at South Alabama. Bradley throws. Lacey is open. Colin Lacey with speed. Goodbye. Started great. They picked up 27 yards on their first three plays. They've been anemic since, and that's picked off. Taken away by South Alabama. Allen Bowman throws it right to Marquise Robinson. Alabama inside the 20. Bradley gives to LaDamian Webb. Bounces it outside. Webb sniffing the end zone. Touchdown. Snap it at one. Bradley throws long again. Lacey behind the defense. He's got him. Touchdown. His career long is 50 plus. Guajardo sticks it. I figured something out offensively. Webb again. The seize part. And there goes three. LaDamian Webb. In a foot race. Touchdown. Just call. Stick a fork in him. Third down and ten. South brings four, and they get there. Second down and ten. Sanders. Here's a little screen. And they find Edwards. He breaks it back with running room on the ball. Edwards. Down to the sideline. Dylan Edwards. Touchdown, Colorado. Team. TCU. Down at home. And they run the football with Bailey. Bailey with a lane and goes down. More often here in the second half. Morse again looking in zone. Caught. Touchdown. Finish. Third down. Morris. Intercepted. Wow. Travis Hunter. You're kidding me right now. That was wide open from the booth. A hundred times out of a hundred, I see that action from up here. That's a touchdown. The Horn Frogs. Morris steps into his throw. But that's he's played so far. Third down and nine to the 23. Morris off his back foot over the middle. It's caught. First down and more. Touchdown, Dalen Wright. Completion behind him. Horn, eight catches, 76 yards. Sanders goes deep once again. This time it's caught. The vacancy. Second and two at the seven. They pitch it out wide. Touchdown, Dylan Edwards. He had chipped one year ago. And they'll swing it out into the flats. This time it's Savion Williams. In the last 10 minutes, that's what's going to pop up. First down and 10 of the 19. And look at Morris. Touchdown. What a fake. Shador Sanders looking. Throwing it deep. Sanders! And it's caught at the 40. Guess who? And at the 26. Sanders. Sprinting. Sets. Delivers. Touchdown, Colorado! I can tell you that. I don't know. You threw for four <laughs> bills. That's big time. They'll start from the five yard line. Everhart. And here's Major Everhart galloping down the sideline. Major Everhart, can he get there? Down at the five. This is just too soft in the middle, and there he goes. Touchdown. Touchdown. Sanders off his back foot, caught first down and more down the sideline. Stop and start, Edwards. Touchdown, Colorado. Battle in the backfield. Here's Morris. He'll throw it with time. Sideline battle breaks a tackle and picks up a first here. down. Here's Morris in trouble, lets it go, caught, and not enough. Again, deliberate. They frequently run the play clock down a lot. In the end zone, touchdown. First chance for Texas on offense in the second half. It's CJ Baxter. The ball comes out, and that is the first. Texas turnover of the night. Knocked out by Braylon Trice. The first two-score lead of the night. They fake the short one. They throw for Westover. And another perfect throw. Right down the middle. Penix, another design run. And it is good. And Texas trying to pick up the pace on offense. Wide open. Jaden Blue, nice cut. Couple of nice moves. And all of a sudden, they're down inside the 23. The ball came out. The ball was recovered by the defense. First 
Stan Washington. We well, heard the referee Ron Snodgrass. It was a fumble. It took a while for there to be a recovery, but at the end it was Braylon Trice. State of Washington. Ewers down the sideline for Worthy. They faked it to him, and it is caught. It was thrown for 398. Trying to get above 400, and he's on target. Championship game if he can split those uprights, and he did. Ewers has rushed for 46 yards. They averaged 6.6 .6 per carry. He lost it for Sanders, caught 31 yard. 28 is third most in Big 12 conference history. The record is 30, but Josh Lambert of West Virginia. Lima to pop it over their heads and go chase it. They're not going to do it. It needs to go 10 yards to execute this turnaround. Michael knew the offense. They did off-season workouts. Were Two, because that clock was going to go all the way under 20 seconds. He gets it off. Whittington almost interfered with. He was interference. Closest to the line in the three receivers to the right. Ewers lofts it up. There's single coverage, and it's gone. Have not led tonight. Trying to take the lead in the final seconds to the sideline. Caught by Blue. In the last chance to advance to the national championship game. Ewers lobs it up, and it is incomplete. I sure appreciate your time. Thank you. This is 56 yards, and that's got a little extra juice. 41, Asante in motion, play action Peasley. Pumps, shovels it, catch there. That's Asante. He can fly. Caleb Driscoll is a fullback here. Play action Peasley, rolling, throwing, caught there. That's Driscoll. That's a touchdown. Second and 10. Blitz comes again. Peasley under pressure. Over the middle. It's Whelan with the catch. 45. Whelan to the 40. Knocked out of bounds at the 38. Fourth and two. Left tackle. Frank Carter. That is a first down. Hand off. That's Scott. That's a touchdown. Got to get to the 31. Shot to throw. Does. Short. Caught there. That's McCray. They block it. Those were overtime wins. First time in school history, both, both those teams in the same year. Peasley's flushed and racing for the sideline. Gets a block. Nicely done. And he's That's hit out of bounds. Looks it And there's is. the flag. Hi, this is 31. A little bit of a tricky angle. And a chip shot for him. Put in 15. Crowd into it. Shot. Moving. Throwing. Caught there. Bradley. Midfield. Last one blocked. This one not, and it is! Oh, off the upright! And no good! Uh, rule changes this season to shorten games for safety. Shock again. Tight window. Caught. Bradley with it. Boom, then it hits the upright. They want this ball in the end zone. Pump fake. Shot deep, and it's caught! Brown! Snap is good. Kick is up, and that kick is good! Peasley's going to keep it, racing for the sidelines, and Peasley's out of bounds. Wheel it in motion. Peasley, Peasley, touchdown! They get it off. Brooks bangs into the end zone. First possession, second overtime. Shock oh. lobs it, man open, Bradley there, touchdown! Blitz comes, Peasley hit as he throws, it's caught! Touchdown Wyoming! Peasley, Scott, touchdown is in! The point is good! Wyoming wins it! Coordinator's son, he was injured earlier in the game on a punt. Nope, Just a three-man rush. McLean. Caught. In a couple of weeks. I think Blake nope. struggled. Chapin has a man open. Maybe that'll change your opinion. Need to get to the 10. Chapin throws it dark. There's one of his tight ends. He looks right, but he comes back, drives the ball right over to the center. 
And a touchdown. There's Pendergrass. 17, which is kind of okay. I get it. Shapen. Does he have a lane? Lobs it back in the end zone. Touchdown. Wide open on last play here. How about this time? This time it works. This is Baldwin. And he's pushed out of bounds at the 16. Second tackle for a loss as a team for UCF. Shapen. Oh, did he? Yes, he did. Monterey Baldwin. The 10 minute mark of our fourth quarter. Play action. is rolling and Blake Shapen feels unstoppable right now. Shapen has a man. It's going to work. Baylor. And, and I think UCF, like you said, should slow it down. Oh, Harvey fumbled the snap. Look at this. This has got a chance to be huge. Caden Jenkins. He's going to get there. The Baylor Bears. The miracle continues. Low snap. McLean. Just a four-man rush. They can't get It, it's zero. Little dump out to Baldwin. And Baldwin still on his feet. Baldwin, he's got a chance. One day for speed, and he's knocked down. Seven. Play action. Shaping. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely crushed. Snap is a beauty. And the kick is even better. Coming after. They're coming after. Second and 13. Gary Green lets it fly. It is nice incomplete. Defense. Great yeah, defensive play. Yeah, and he's play. Yeah. He comes late, and then he brings it in for you a You had pick. a tip. Now, you got two guys collaborating here. Watch 25 on the trail oh. technique. Punch it out. Down by his battle remains. Meantime, University of Houston is doing a fantastic job. Now another explosive. Hello. Could be going on the way. How do you do, Stacey? <laughs> Down, but there's enough distance between them. He's going to get at least 7 to 10 yards. Third and three to Manjack. The USC transfer. Touchdown. Texas. That's their sixth tackle for loss. Green with time. On the post. And it's caught by Carter. Houston comes with a corner blitz. Pass is caught. Oh, and it's good for a first down. Number four, too. And Green oh, looks to make it. it. I don't think he got there either. He got it. West Virginia's best. I just mentioned it, <laughs> and Never they didn't give it. a signal Never at no it. point. First and 10 at the West Virginia 40. Smith, nice, good go ball. Got a corner. Oh, he missed him. Oh, got him late. There's Manjack. Right now, Smith, fade, fade pattern. Brown nice. has got it. Touchdown. Second down and 22. Smith with all oh, kinds God. of time. That is a first down and then some. Going for the touchdown, hey, and he is caught. It's Rob Jackson. <laughs> Green out of the gun. Taylor the tight end again. Now that's why. It's now off schedule. Remember, West Virginia still has three timeouts. They need to score, though. It's going to take two possessions. Green will touch it. But if you can protect, it can actually be to your advantage. Yeah, more space to work with. Here's Green. That pass is caught. Catch it to the yep. hot corner, man. Yep. That thing came out of there hot. Oh, and look at this. Oh, <laughs> double oh. clutch. They bring four. Green's pass to the tight end, and he'll be a go-to guy here. Green looking, throwing, caught. Devin Carter, interception earlier. Fourth and ten, ball game on the line. Green's pass, caught! Wow. And look out! It's Clement! He might score! Pass completions in a row. This will be his last, and it's for the football game. If he can get it off. To the end zone. Tipped, and 
He caught it. Stefan Jackson does it again. That ball in the direction of the trail receiver, Spencer. Well, this is why they call it the jump, the jump yes. drill, right? Yeah. The tip drill is there for the purpose of. In Louisiana, Hank Bachmeyer complete to Harris on the outside on the screen. Blockers ahead. Harris trying to shake his way free. Has it out for a first. The kick is up, and the kick is one. There's Harris on the edge. Harris slipping away from the tackles. Harris makes him smoke. Harris just inside of him in the slot. Pressure coming on third down. Give it to Moody. He has enough. The 43-yard field goal attempt is no good. Fire here in the fourth and Rustin. Need a quick stop here. Instead, it's Patterson breaking. Bachmeyer over the middle, tipped and almost picked. Bachmeyer on fourth down, pressure picked up. Slug caught, first down. Allen has it near midfield. Bachmeyer bobbles the snap again, but completes out of the backfield, slipping away. And inside the 35-yard line, Tech is outgained FIU. And yet the Panthers still have a chance. Touchdown, Louisiana Tech. And the Bulldogs take the lead with a minute and one. James and the Panthers hoping for a miracle at this point. Tipped, and it's picked off, and Louisiana Tech will win. Intercepted over the middle. Cecil Singleton comes away. Rattler looking, throwing, end zone, wide open. Touchdown, Xavier Leggett. But listen, who's your threat? They're playing a little zone and passing off, and no one pays attention to Leggett. And you know, when you're playing zone coverage like that, you have to know where the other threat is coming from, particularly number 17. Minute 40. Left in the corner. Rattler looking. Going downfield. Leggett. Got it. Leggett. Lose. Leggett. Touchdown. Once again. South Carolina. Just like that. For the lead. Good. Webb throwing. Blanton is coming out to try to make sure he gets the running back. Has to take a wide, wide range there. That ball is late. And boy, is he on time. With a convoy to the end zone. 87-yard pick six by Stone Blanton. Play along with me is what you're saying. <laughs> Not nice. <laughs> Salter back to throw. Back corner of the end zone, drops it in to Bentley Hanshaw for the Liberty touchdown. Play action, Nix looking downfield, floats one, guess who? The brotherly connection, it's Tez Johnson again. It's from 37 yards out. And this one's perfect. Trying to be too cute and go after records and run the ball down Liberty's throat. There they go again, Irving into the secondary. Into the red zone, turns the corner with a blocker out in front, down to the five yard line. Play action. Nix rolls across his body, back of the end zone. A wide open touchdown for Gary Bryant Jr. The flip for Tez Johnson. Speed to the edge, inside the five. Play action again. Nix. Almost lost his balance, maintains, and finds Terrence Ferguson for the touchdown. Nix from the end zone with a pump fake. He's going to take a shot for Bryant. Perfectly on time to midfield and past. Oregon has made it a point that they're going to be physical and run the football. A little jet sweep, and Bo Nix with that one touch ahead. Salter, long throw to the sideline. That's Bob. 
and may have been intercepted on the carom. Minute drill, you take a ton of time off and don't give yourself the opportunity to take more shots down the field like that. There's a seam shot, running free is Johnson. And he'll slide down, give himself up. Here comes a blitz. Nix, seam shot, end zone, sliding catch made by Treshawn Holden for the Oregon touchdown. Trick play, a flea flicker, back to Bo Nix. They set up the screen to Tez Johnson. Blockers in front, a freeway to the end zone for a touchdown. The ball's batted down at the line. Flag down, Irving dives. He's into the end zone for the touchdown. Extreme development this year and wants to play in the NFL next year. Continue to play hard, make great decisions. Uh oh, CJ Daniels lost the football. Must score drive for Louisiana Tech in some fashion. Throw goes to the outside. Allen is there. He's knocked out of bounds. It is a reception. A 30 yard field goal try. Well within the range of Jacob Barnes. Snap is good. The placement is down. The kick is up, and the kick is good. It's going to be Barnes on the dribbler. This ball is loose. Who's got it? It was a dribbler. It evaded. Tech emerges with the football. And at the 47-yard line. Turner hands it off. There's running room for Shelton. He breaks outside. He's got a first down. That will stop the clock. Now the clock will start. A quick sling out to Harris. Smoke fighting to get out of bounds, and he does. Jack Turner wants the ball. Jack Turner slings it out to Harris again. Bursts on the speed. Stays on his feet. Makes a man miss. Inside the 10. Inside the 5. Touchdown! Smoke Harris! Where there's smoke, there's fire. He moving those arms. You see him in the very left-hand corner at the bottom. Getting the crowd involved. Rodgers chunks it downfield. He's got a receiver. Rodgers sprints that way. Being chased from the backside, slings it. He's got a man for a first down. Rodgers will hand it off to Adehi, and he is loose. He's on the sideline. He runs out of bounds inside the 15 at the 14. Seven seconds to go. And now North Texas is in very reasonable field goal range. At North Texas. Rauschenberg lines it up from 32 yards. The kick is up. The kick is good. It was, it was coming fast. On first and 10, Shoemaker with play fake. Ooh. Intercepted at the 46-yard line. Racing back down the far side to the 30-25 to 25 and tackled at about the 17-yard line. Willis starts in motion toward the line of scrimmage. Vadiata wants to throw across the middle. Intercepted at the 31-yard line. Back to the 20. This is Williams to the 10, to the 5. Trevor Williams with a pick six for Sam Houston. Filling by three. Vadiata wants to throw. Looking deep down the middle, and the ball is intercepted. intercepted. Coming back from the 20-yard line to the 40, to midfield. Still on the run. And being brought down there, Isaiah Downs with the pick. Holding call on it well. Puts it at the three. Body to throw from his own end zone. Deep on the far sideline, and it is caught or broken what up. What a catch. Riles going to take it and go back to his right. Cuts, got to the goal line, and in. Shoemaker gets the snap. Just a three-man rush. Throws it over the middle. Caught across midfield. Inside the 45 and down to the 42, maybe the 41-yard line to left. Handoff. Running play. Bouncing outside oh, wow. to the 30, to the 25, and out of bounds. Stands. Throws the slant. Caught at the 10. At the 5. Down to about the 3-yard line. And the ball off. Gentry will score untouched. John Gentry from three yards out puts the Bearcats back on top. Good snap and hold. Rankin's kick is on the way, but it's going to be no good. Wide to the right, and time expires. And Sam Houston will win it by a score of 23-20. to For the end zone for the first time in this game, they get the snap off in time. Shaker steps up. He's going to run with it, and he is into the alley. Drive for the Rainbow Warriors. Third and goal. Shager 
Throws to the end zone. It is caught. Koali Nishigaya. And Hawaii pending the PAT. With a chance to tie this thing up. He sound. Shager going to do exactly what you said, Rich. He goes down, gives himself up as he centers the football. Hawaii can use one of its timeouts. They do. And so this will be an opportunity. Go down, no doubt, when it's said and done. As one of the best field goal kickers in this program's history. Can he do it right here? 24 yards out. Solomon Landrum with the snap. The kick is up. And it is good. Hawaii walks it off in its final non-conference game. For back run. Third five, Shoemaker to throw, wants the end zone. Batted up and incomplete, but there's a late flag in. Two-time national champ. On third down and goal. Did he get there? I don't think so. No, he's short. Fourth down's coming up as the clock winds. Coco Brown's the running back. Fourth and goal. Panel keeps it. He's got daylight. He's got six. Empty on first and ten. Smothers has struggled tonight. Completes here to Quinton Lane. Minute eight to go. On second down, that pass is complete. It should be a first down left for Logan Smothers, the Nebraska transfer. Completes over the middle. It was a bobble and a catch. And Perry dragging defenders across midfield. Interception kind of slowed him down. They snapped it right on the number. Complete again. Up the seam. It's Sterling Galban. They snap it. From the 30, Smothers gets rid of it. Oh, he should have dropped it. That's still going to run. Malik Jackson, the running back, was down inbound, so the Sp clock is winding. I don't know why what the, the, the clock started running when the chains weren't set. And they got to spike it, so third and long coming up with just 18 seconds left. That's going to do you no good. Crowd gets loud on third and eight. Smothers throws middle of the field. It's caught. Smothers looking left, flushed, Smothers throws, end zone, Quinton Lane's got it. Didn't think we'd see a lot of offense, 56 points. College football, Way baby. over what we thought. Expect the unexpected. That's right. Now Sam Houston's got a shot of the kick return. Malik Phillips turns the corner, out of bounds near the 45. And Stanford, Steve. The shoemaker just needs some time to get rid of it, and this will end regulation. That's not going to be a completed pass. That was the game tying score. He looks to throw here, second down and nine, floats it, end zone, touchdown. Keegan Shoemaker throws left, wants end zone, incomplete. Need to convert or the game is over. Jacksonville State brings the house, pass incomplete. Zach Alley dials up the pressure. Fred Perry brings it, and the Gamecocks win on the road in overtime. But that's a penalty all day long. Midfield now. Jackson breaks a tackle, gets loose. Jackson's 20. Jackson to the 10. Out at the 5. Broussard ran him down. Oh, With Rich Rodriguez. Jackson left side. Into the end zone. Touchdown, Gamecocks. Hardison airs it out. End zone. Caught. No. Did he get it? Akari. Touchdown. Hankins in the backfield. They'll throw it. Hardison looking, looking, fires. And it's intercepted. The game cocks. Oh, goodness. Western Kentucky. Webb going up top down the middle. This one is picked. Jabari Mack with the interception. And he with 47 tackles now this season. Reed coming near side. Has a man pass. Is caught, bobbled, and dropped. Oh, my goodness. To 131 yards. Well, nice grab. Picked right out of the air by Jason Jones. He's being 20 of 41, 216. Three-man rush. Little shovel pass underneath. Big gainer here for LT Sanders. He's to midfield. Webb over the middle. This time it's caught. 
Over the middle, pass is caught. That'll be good enough for the first down. Four by one, the reverse action. He'll fake the reverse. There's the tight end, Sean Brown. A little split zone. And a big hole. Anwar Lewis with the touchdowns. Third down. The four-man game. Pass caught on the far side out to the 32-yard line. Look for by Western Kentucky. Get it to Lewis, and he breaks a tackle. Uh, breaks another tackle, and he's out to the 43. Second down and 10. Here comes some pressure. Webb throws underneath. There is P.J. Wells with the catch. He breaks a tackle. He's inside the 35. Career long is 46. He's done it four different times. Here's Lewis. He's to the 25 and down at the 24-yard line. Hold this team to a field goal. If possible. Here's Webb. Slides down at the 16-yard line. And this is for the win. He slips on the field goal attempt. Does it get through? Yes. Up the middle. And a crease. Touchdown, Army. Tyrell. I, I do lunch, on yeah. I didn't go to Dean's out. <laughs> Garlow explodes. Pat Garlow caught from behind. Pick up a 50 on the ground. Castellano follows it up, angles outside, the joystick to the end zone. It off, first and goal. Green, powerful legs into the end zone. Bailey, catch it, and it in there for a touchdown. The Tyson goal from the one. Castellano's off right side, scoots in. Touchdown, Boston College. They take the lead. Third and 15. The toss over the middle. Ball out. Reynolds made the initial catch. Boston College picks it up. Roll to fumble. BC possession. On fourth and one, and let the power back try to get it. So Ohio State's benefit, and now a big game for Henderson. Bucks it to the outside. Henderson's got speed down the sideline. Nobody's going to catch him. Touchdown, Ohio State. On first and goal. Direct snap. Payne up the middle. Stopped initially, but kept fighting for the touchdown. Hartman going to the air. Looking end zone. Wide open. Touchdown, Irish. Rico Flores. McCoy to throw on second down. Another completion. Diving grab from Harrison. McCord hit McCord keeps the football lets it loose and he throws it away it's close and they do throw the flag here and this will end up being intentional grounding intentional grounding offense number six three-man rush McCord floats it end zone caught short Abuka makes the catch inside the one it's the last play of the game Give it to him. Train him up the middle. He's in. Touchdown, Ohio State. They walk it off at Notre Dame Stadium. Oh, God. Strong in the pocket. Lasers and cuts. As a two-way performer. Two-way stars. Royals. Sideline. PS speed. Four. Watch him zoom. He can in fact slow down because he walks in for the score. Quick goes to God. Post route on target. Royals. Third touchdown. It gets through. Third and 13. Roberson with time. Starts to run out of it and is brought down at the one. Needing a touchdown. Roberson to the air. Down the sideline. It's brought in. Quarterbacks can run a lot in this coverage. Roberson, clean pocket. Fires in. Caught. Ross. First down. Clock resets. A minute 11 on this snap. Roberson. Fan ball. Buckman. Holds it in. And out of bounds at the two. Climbs the ladder for 25 yards. Off right guard with the tight end pushing him from behind. There it is, right guard run to Stafford. Second effort. 
He's in! The Grizzly touchdown! And UConn's an extra point away from tying it. For the first down, like the, for the touchdown, like the Energizer Bunny there. Important extra point is blocked! Oh my! That's Larson who came in, and it's blocked! So Utah State remains in front by one! First half. Snap is down. Carson gets into it a little better this time, and it is good. So Cam Carson, four, and it's White in the back again. They'll give it to him right side, and White gets to the line again, and then some still on his feet. 36 going to walk off the edge. Davis back to throw. Davis dumps it off. It is complete to Pope. Stand in for Davis. Now he'll throw it out to the far side. It's complete. Simpson driving to the outside. He gets face masked as well. There's Davis rolling out, throws underneath, and it is deflected, looking for Simpson. Ivan, you know, I can say I played with both those guys, so that's a pretty cool fact. Dontrell <laughs> Moore actually the color analyst for the New Mexico today. Fair point, six feet, 195. Hasten all handed off, up the middle. It's Karon Lynch Adams shedding defenders inside the 30, down to the 25. Offense, third down, Simpson in motion. Hasten's going to take off on a design draw, up the middle, lost the football, and in the air, it's going to be Josh Atwood. Go to his left side. It just seems like there's something going on. Third and nine, Davis to the end zone, and it is incomplete. Snap is down, held by Kaloji, and towards the Football Performance Center, he batter ram, battering rams it through. Sherrod White, play action. Hopkins has pressure, shakes off one man and dumps it off into the flat, and Krosky Merritt is gone along third and 13. They need to get into UMass territory. And they'll throw to the far sideline. It is brought in and intercepted by Massett. Really cost UMass the game in the end. We'll keep it on the ground to Karon Lynch Adams. Lynch Adams trying to get to the outside. He does. He's got the first down, leaving defenders in his football is going to be the focus. They'll swing it out to Simpson. Simpson catches and then turns up field. Simpson looking for more yardage, makes another move and is down. Catches for 51 yards for Simpson. Haston. Gaining some confidence, back to throw, looking downfield, and now he tries to take off. Move, trying to get rid of the football. Back and forth he goes. 18, long way to go. Could be the game. Blitz. Haston, looking downfield, fires to the far sideline. It is complete to Campiotti, trying to keep it along. Rodriguez out to boot it away, and he gets another good one off. Drifting Ross back and forcing him to call the fair catch, and then he picks up the football. Haston. Will turn, little RPO, keeps the football, dives forward, a headlong 35-yard line, six-yard pickup. Stayed at 102 on the first down. Haston to the air, looking downfield, chucks it deep, and Simpson is there, he makes the catch at the 25-yard line, looking to the end zone, it's the true freshman. Well, empty out the backfield, third and four. Haston again, design draw up the middle, and Haston trying to pick his way to the line again. He's going to be about a yard and a half. Carson, already a couple of field goals today. This one from 33. And Cam Carson sends it through. It is good. Yards if needed. Hopkins, play action. Pressure comes, throws to the end zone. It is incomplete, and a flag down of is the tailback. Hopkins. We'll keep it. Rush to the outside. Hopkins makes a move and dragging defenders into the end zone. He is. Keep an eye on them. Prosky Merritt the back. They'll give it to him. He gets tripped up. Stretches to the goal line. Touchdown, New Mexico. They beat Syracuse. And trying to get a big memory tonight. And this breaks for a big play. Lorenzo Lincoln. Jackson pulls it, pumps on it, and he gets sacked. No timeouts for Irons in the Akron offense. And he does take off. Nobody in the picture for Indiana, and he can run for a long way into field goal range and out of bounds. Akron looking for a signature win on the road at Indiana. Jackson puts it up and dunks it. He did not hit it. Regulation. Missed field goal, got us to overtime with a chance to win it for the Zips. Quick feet for Irons, and on the move again for a first down. The first possession of overtime. Irons, running 
falling away from pressure. Around Carter. Irons cuts back. DJ Irons pulls his way into the end zone. After his first down carry. Lucas is in the route, instead going underneath McCulley. And he's a start next weekend at Maryland's. In survival mode in overtime. Jackson on the move to the end zone. Taven Jackson and they do bring pressure Jackson runs away from it and yes, incomplete the new audience as Indiana tries to go ahead in a second overtime against Akron and Freeman puts it through and missed to send us to overtime a touchdown can win it for the Zips Irons on the move again Irons across the 15 the ball in DJ Irons hands game on the line it's Lingard stumbling ahead and regulation for the tie, Dante Jackson sends this to triple overtime. And triple overtime. Irons to throw. Irons running away from Carr. A flag comes out and it's thrown out of the back of the end zone. Jackson named the starting quarterback last week with a chance to win it. Jackson with time. Jackson has it. No down and intercepted. So Jackson motions out. The former high school quarterback, McCauley, running a reverse. Jackson to throw, completes it for the two-point try. Irons, given time, and it's incomplete. Resilience and survival. From the five, Cooper, touchdown, Ball State. It's second down and 20, fourth. Pressure, he's got a wide open man, it's Fannin Jr. He's got the catch for the first down. Inside the 30 at Ball State. Two tight end set to the right. Second and short. Hand off to Keith. And he goes inside a five, he's close to the goal line. Back in, got to be a pass. Connor Bazelak, he's going to throw it. And the catch is made and it's a touchdown to Teron Keith. Possession here. Cooper. Breaks free across the 40. Going back to the left of Kelly. Guns in on the crossing round. The catch is made by Ahmad Edwards. What a... Kelly. There he goes. First down down the sideline. There's nobody there. One guy now comes back. He cuts in front of him for the time. Pierce, number 40. He's coming. Nope. Bazelak, and the catch is made. He's got Hilaire, and he's got the first... Put it in the end zone yeah. and call it up. Bazelak, Keith's got the catch. Goes down the sideline. You got to get to Ron Keith now involved in the pass game. Baselak. He's got to just throw it away. Nobody is open. And now Alan Anaya has come on for the field goal attempt. 22 yards. For the freshman Jackson Corville from Dayton, Ohio to tie the ball game. Four seconds left. 52 yard field goal. It has distance. No good. 41. You feel Toledo has to capitalize here. Finn. Finn steps up, fires to the end zone. Touchdown, Junior Vander Ross. And he's gonna. Blitz was picked up well. Wide open. And seven. Orth gonna try and pick it up with his feet. Fumble. Ball's loose. Max in hook. Eight minutes off the clock. Third and 13. Toledo sends pressure. Bazelak dialing up a deep shot. Newton will make plays. Finn right back. And now Penny Boone out of the back. Inside the 15. Right back to Boone, and he punches it in. To get within a field goal, Finn bobbled the snap, throws off his back foot, floats it. Orth runs it himself, has the first down and more. Long is 42. Anaya. Finn fires over the middle, it's caught. It was the line to gain. Newton got there. Pressure coming. 
Finn escapes. And it's third and nine. Pressure coming. Finn in trouble. Steps up, throws. This is your ball game. Finn floats it. The gas! Touchdown! Right side. Stewart just gets out to the flat. Fresh set of downs for the Rams. Fakes the handoff. Montez throwing deep down the near side. MJ right. He is got it inside the 30. Loses his balance. Ball from just inside the 10. Fakes the handoff. Throws to the near corner. Makai Felton. He's got it for the touchdown. A wildcat takes the direct snap. Bouncing it outside to the right. He's brought down. Something short. Fake the handoff, throw over the middle. It's caught by Cody, there who's back in the game for a first down. It's been a huge gain as they hand it off to Luffridge again. Big gain, Luffridge across midfield. One on one with a defender and brought down at the 35 yard line. Fake the handoff, Montez throws far corner. Makai Felton for the touchdown. Second of the game, Makai Felton. Tash. Kick is up, it's got the distance. It is good. Walk off the field. Take a look at some games coming up on ESPN Plus next week in Maction, Central Connecticut at Kim. There's a lot blue. of swings in this he game has, in the momentum. That's what I'm talking about. Mo Michelle after the 41. As we come under a minute left in the first, in the third quarter. Throw far side. Caught again by Felton, who's back in the game. C.J. Stroud of the Houston Texans works out there. As Montez throws deep. Hit as he throws. It is caught inside the... Do the backfield. Back to pass. Throws over the middle. Huge hit short of the goal line at the one yard line. High snap. Montez throws into the corner. Caught by Garrett Cody for the go ahead touchdown. Buffalo needs to answer. Cole Snyder throws the quick pass near side. It is caught. And I think they just got it on the second effort. Right. Senior quarterback Cole Snyder back to pass, throws far side. It is caught for a first down. Snyder protected well, throws deep near side for Johnson. He's got it for the touchdown. Here they come. Picked up, throw far side. It is caught. Number one. It's a handoff running over the left side and picking up a first down. Luffridge inside the 35. To Here comes the blitz. Montez throws the slant. It's caught inside the five. Touchdown! MJ Rush. Throws over the middle into traffic. It's caught for a first down and five from the 46. Snyder throws. Caught for a first down across midfield to the 45. Four yards, so they need to get it to about the 35. Throw over the middle. And they get a lot of that yardage back to the 37 yard line. Good hold. Kick is up. It is. No good! Snap to Bauer. He'll keep it. You called it. Bauer straight ahead. Central Michigan on the move, trying to make it a one possession game. Bauer going to run for the first down. He's got a lot of room. Back. Bauer looking to the end zone, throwing to the end zone. Ball caught as he <laughs> relates to people, and he's kept his guys in this game. Quick shot out to the flat. Good enough for a first down. Carry the football. Little trickery as Gilly handles to the outside, beats a man. And in a secondary, he's got the first down. Marquez Cooper to the outside, makes another man miss. And is forced out of bounds, but he snapped back. Kelly to the end zone, touchdown! He did. I think he still has the newspaper from the, that game. <laughs> it's hanging up in his house. Mm -hmm. Lukes has touched the ball at least 16 times today, receiving and running. Another first down coming up. Bauer delivering again. They do need a first down. Bauer on the rollout, looking. Now going to go back the other way. He's got a man wide open. Got it to him. End zone. He's for 20 left. Bauer, Luke straight ahead to the end zone. Touchdown, Central Michigan. Team on third and eight. Bauer. Out of the pocket, in trouble. Pierce nearly got to him. Luke straight ahead. I don't know if he got it, though. It's close. Pushing this ball down the field. Bauer looking to do that to the sidelines. Ball caught first down. Here comes the pressure. 
Bauer steps up over the middle ball. Caught. Is it caught? No, incomplete. Looking sharp. Little play fake. Quick throw open. Got the open. Smith under duress. Now he improvises and he skips outside looking for a block downfield oh, at the line. Oh, they're going to throw a little fade route deep and caught in the end zone. Some max protect again. Eight man. Oh, oh the point after is blocked and Central Michigan is going to scoop it up. A special teams opportunity of blockers. CMU. Badgett. Still think it's in their favor. On the ground. Boy, there's a good run in the middle. Play fake. Oh, little jump pass. Caught in space. Little end around there with Thomas Panunzio. Opportunities. You want to get points whenever you can get them from now on. 27 yards out for Tristan Matson, And that is Michigan. Oh, they're coming hard. Now he steps up. And he runs. Can he get to space? He shakes off one potential tackler. Play fake. Complete in space to Canoe, who rips it up the middle inside the five. Sorry, Eastern's trying to get the score. On the ground, Evans. Touchdown, Eastern Michigan. Smith, they're coming, and they take him down. Bauer, hands off. Big speed for Marion Lukes inside the 10. Touchdown score. Deep throw, wide open and caught by Eastern Michigan. All throughout this game. Here comes pressure, a little comeback screen. Ball is juggled. Can they get the first down? No. Smith, oh, he lobs it deep. And it is dropped. I throw here. Oh, tight throw and a good catch for earlier from 46 yards out. And it is no good. Big play for Eastern defensively. Oh, they're going to run a jet sweep. And this is going to be a big first down pickup. And Central Michigan's... Going under center seems to not even be a thought. Fake the gift to Lingard. George has work to do. Bounces off a tackle and he gets there. So Akron stays alive here. Fake another gift to Lingard. Undercuffler looking that way. Instead throws. Intermediate. Got his man. Oh, it's third down and one. They, they need the 35. Short. Surprised by that. Doesn't matter as Lingard. Deep. And this drive started at 44 seconds to go. In that third quarter. Will it end here with a touchdown? Josiah Gaithings brings it in. Third and ten, under Cuffler throws it quickly, completes it. Josiah Gaithings was the hero on the last drive, and he's got a first down here. Pacific, Akron faces a third and one. They handle Lorenzo Lingard, look out! Lingard with speed, splits the defense, and goes all the way! This game is not over yet! Thinking, we don't need the field goal. Who cares about that situation? Let's go win it with a touchdown. They've got over three minutes to do Three wide for under Cuffler. Looking middle. Got Throwing a middle. Wants it all. Gay things got wrapped up. There are two flags down. One minute to play. Undercuffler throws. Lingard. Nice grab out of the backfield. 31 seconds left. Second and goal. Back to Lingard. No, they faked it. Undercuffler keeps and scores. They've scored three touchdowns in a row to take the lead. Devin Cardman. Hasn't played this year. This is his first snap, and he goes down. The wagon wheel will come back to Akron. Come back. Tracy, right up the gut. Grinding toward the goal line. He is in. Touchdown, Miami. You know, Wake Forest isn't calling it the slow mesh anymore. They're calling it the hang and bang. <laughs> uh, first down. That pass is intercepted. Ah. First snap for Avion Smith. Is a handoff. Amos is in. Touchdown. Red Hawks. Instead, it's first down and 10. A straight run for Smith. Lost the football. The ball is out. Toledo has it. And the Rockets will ice it. Good analogy, by the way. To the end zone. Touchdown. 
Rushing four, dropping seven. Lombardi loose and completing a pass. In the third quarter, high snap. Bounce to the outside. First down. Play. Eifert's missed two in a row. He won't miss that one, though. Southern Illinois. Lombardi going deep. He's got a man. Caught. Touchdown. Over oh. there. Going for two. Double reverse. Thrown in the end zone. Caught. Now, plenty of time to throw the ball. Down the field and picked off. Northern back 20 yards. Lombardi for the first down with a strike across the 45 yard line. Run. Incomplete. Big play. Baker to the outside. Incomplete. Ops. No good. Man rush. They'll drop eight. And still got pressure on Lombardi. How about that? Seibert warming up. Lombardi with time over the middle. Picked off. Third interception of the game for the Salukis. Vince Stiffens yet again. Ohio U for a field goal of 31. Oh, this nice one is badly hooked. You just nailed it right there, <laughs> Here's Harris on first down. Wigless on the crossing pattern. The skin of cat, man. Dalen Armstead in the backfield, and there he goes. Right up the go. go. Number two, picking him up and putting him down. Here he comes, bull rushing passes. Oh, nice. oh the turf monster. And it would have been a first down. It is Armstead. And he has the first down. Conservatively, this is a 21 yard field goal for Browning, and he got it. Oh, this oh, year. Yeah. They could repeat. Nice job. Off the blitz, an open Redman, he's got it. This is where having a really deep roster in San Diego State does. Their legs appear fresh. Nice and spot control. Another is Brooks. They're going to re- Tied to the top of the screen. Oh, they would have got him to switch. Quick out. <laughs> it's right there for Kristen. And Davis is in the backfield. Oh, the middle. It's caught. It's touchdown. It's the tight end, Redman. This is a six-man blitz here. There's a quick move on the slant to Walton, a delayed slant. They're backing out, though. There's oh, his pass for Wigless. He's got it. First down at the 36-yard line. National title. Mm-hmm. Here's Harris. No, CJ! Inside the 20. Here's what they do offensively when Rourke is out of the game. There's the tight end oh. again. Pass a little underthrown to Kazmarek. It's touchdown. Or very close to a touchdown. It's almost like that ball had a string on the end yeah. of it, right? Each other. And they got to do it under pressure. Harris. Intercepted. Taken away. On first and goal. Nice. The corner route. Bingo. There it is. Yep. Miles Cross for the touchdown. Fight's really improved, as has the Mac. And so many other conferences around the country. Sun Belt and American of Kazmarek. They got to get to the boundary some kind of way, to yeah. the edges. They got to get to the edges. That, oh, my God. And it is to again. He does get a first down. Yeah. On third down and 10. Walton's got it. He's a yard shy of yeah. the first down. And there he, yep. As far back as the 20 yard line, they await. Harris's pass wow. is intercepted. That's what happens. Junior Vandeross, five catches, 71 yards tonight. And now here is an attempt to Vandeross and another catch for him. And still on his feet inside the 35 yard line of Illinois. From the 32, first down. And here's a run for Stewart. And it opens up for Jaquez Stewart. Stewart racing toward the sideline, bumped out of bounds. Motion, Jerwan Newton. Finn with time to throw, overthrows the intended receiver. Wow. Marker down, Stewart the intended receiver. No foul, roughing the passer, defense number 17. Half the distance to the goal, automatic first down. I'd be able to account for him in this thing. Here is Finn, 
They do play action. He sprints to the corner and is in for the touchdown. Toledo has taken the lead with just under three minutes left in Champaign. Version attempt after the timeout. Finn, shovel pass, and Stewart lost it. Illinois has two timeouts. We're under two and a half to play. Altmaier looking, and he's hit as he throws, and it's incomplete. It's McCray in the backfield. It's Altmaier on fourth down, heaving it down the sideline. On a hand fighting, catch is made. Casey Washington. Chris McDonald had the best coverage he could possibly have, and Washington caught it. Washington, that's unbelievable. Three yards on fourth down and four to Casey Washington, who's had a fairly quiet game, but that is announcing his presence with authority. Isaiah Williams has got a pass on first down in the game. The kick for Griffin is on the money. Inside 30, this one from 40, and that one hooks. Wow. And now Buckley gets it off the short pass from Wolf. Now has room to run. He stick the landing here and knock this one through. From 40, they'll go to the air and the delayed quarterback run here for Rourke. Shifts to his side. Now surges forward with the handoff into the end zone for. Kick from Casey. Field it at the six yard line. Look out. Haley with some blockers near side trying to out of your screen makes it hard to throw deep buckley on the slant has it complete womack shaking free looking for a cutback back. wolf oh he's got it scampering himself can he get to the pylon he's in touchdown Second and ten, fake the run, toss and a big completion in the pass game to Bullen Guy, who's going to take it inside the 20-yard line, shaking his way inside the 10, all the way down to the one. Brought down one out of the gun, toss Lester, trying to find the corner. Lester is in, touchdown UNLV. Harris goes in motion, Jones on a designed run on second and 11, takes it across the 35, first down across the 45-yard line. Jones, option toss, Eldridge on the edge. Shakes his way across the 50. Eldridge out of bounds near the 40-yard line. Third and nine. Here come the Falcons. Bayama, deep shot. White holds it in inside the 25-yard line. Two touchdowns wiped out because of penalty. And now it's Jaden Thomas straight ahead. Jaden Thomas rolling inside the 10. Bayama fakes it, tosses it. Touchdown! Still on the field, first and 10. From the 50, Brumfield is now going to tuck it and run. It's Doug Brumfield inside the 40, diving. If you let it go, you're going to risk getting pinned inside the five. Air Force goes punt safe. They were anticipating it. The throw is caught. First down on the fake. Pisano's kick is easily good. Harris goes in motion. Hand up the middle again to Dylan Carson. Loose football. football. Rebels think they have it. Who's on top at the bottom of the pile? On third and seven. Miala chased and sacked. From the 40. Option keeper Jones across the 45, across the 50. Is in at quarterback for Air Force. Boucher is going to line drive, toss it, caught inside the 25. Dropping. Boucher heaves to the end zone. It is incomplete. Intended for Rillos. No flags. Braden Fowler, Nicolosi. Back to pass four man rush. He takes a shot as he lets it go. Oh. Quickly zips it out to Goffney. Goffney breaks a tackle and picks up the first down. That one he dropped where he took his eye off it. Plenty of time all day for Fowler Nicolosi back over the middle and again it's Horton first down from the 12-yard line. Fowler Nicolosi to the end zone. What a grab! Back again. Yep. Boise State's got the hands. There's Genty right there inside the 50-yard line. Oh, McAllister oh, oh, squirts away. And Colorado 
Ohio State's on it. Keep it on the ground with Van. Van Shield inside the 20 yard line. Everything's condensed. Third and goal. Up top to the corner of the end zone. Brown makes the catch, but Colorado State here. Fourth and goal. Three man rush to the middle of oh, the that's field. PI. Missed. Colorado State trying to score here, and they do. Dylan, if they get a first down, and here's the onside kick, bouncing around. Colorado State has a shot, and they get it. We'll replay the kick. Oh. <laughs> and this time, Rob coming. Green's going to keep it. There he goes. Breaks one tackle, trying to get around the edge. We got Jaylen a penalty Green though. It's coming back. Inbound. Offense number 85. Here's Crow. Puts his head down. Yeah, you got to throw one up and give your guys a chance. Four man rush once again there coming. Fowler Nicolosi stepping up in the pocket, letting it go. Eric Cox running. And a fresh set of downs. Fowler Nicolosi climbing the pocket again. Take a shot here's Horton catching it at the 35. Ever against Boise State one final shot. Fowler Nicolosi chucking it into the end zone. Everybody is there. Is it caught? Is it caught? Colorado State. Dallin Holker makes the catch. It's a miracle in Fort Collins. We're tied up. Oh man. Boise State actually tips it. There's the trailer. That's why you say you teach them to knock it straight down into the ground. They tip it straight. Great positioning. They did. Yeah, that's that's an awesome job right wow. there. Can do what has never been done before in Colorado State history. Oh, the we kick got it. Is up and the kick is good. One tonight from 52, which is a career longest block. You. It says you just got to keep your legs moving. Yeah. She's uh, 850 pounds and she can hit 25 miles an hour. In the backfield catching the football, running the football with authority. Sanders complete to his tight end, Harrison again. Nicolosi into traffic and picked off and finding open holes. Sanders drills it again, complete. From 20 yards out. That's exactly what they did. Easy. They're going to run it and pick up the first down. Johnson, tell you what, if you got a name like Kobe, you know how pressure coming. They picked it up. Caught and room for Holker on the run. Did he get in? Touchdown, Rams. They run it. Edwards with a burst of speed. Got the first down at the 33. Second and one. Sanders. Behind his receiver, but caught. Pressure coming. Sanders got away. Not that time. Sacked back at the 28-yard line. And that's clean. Got it. As a head coach. Easily, Q. Pass complete. Line drive end over end. It is going to dribble out of bounds. Mm. You couldn't have placed it any better. Ten. Sanders complete. Dawson down the sidelines. He'll cup. Sanders complete. And still on his feet. Weaver down to the 42. Brado. Sanders. Downfield. Got him in. Horn! Atonement! Touchdown! He pulls it out, and we're tied! Harrison! To the left of Sanders. Fires incomplete. Again. Number eight defense. Critical. Man. Critical errors. As good of a game as he's played, those are two bad, bad plays. You see the helmet? Yeah. Sanders pulls. Got it. Touchdown, Harrison.
Nicolosi pulls it out on the slant. Horton with the catch. Touchdown. Let's try and protect better and better here in the second half. Sanders open. There he is again. Touchdown, Harrison. Sanders got rid of it. He got it. Nicolosi steps up into the end zone in a crowd. No good. Picked off by Woods and it's over. Wyoming. Yeah, offset. Yep. And there it is. They go pooch. They go nice pooch. Shot. And it worked. Absolutely worked. He Step up now. Hole. Now they got a three deep. Look, this should be underneath. Wide Bingo. open. In the seam. It's yep. caught. It's Delena. There's no state of thing about all those penalties. Eight of them now for 91 yards. And look nice at that pass. Concentration. Big time to Watson. And you're going to get a penalty. We all know Fife in trouble again. Nice job. Doing his best to get away. And look at this. It's caught. Touchdown, Fresno State. Fresno State, it's chance to pull the within five. Nice play fake, and they go to a tight end, Welch. Trade in Welch down the sideline before being bumped out to Fresno State. Whaley. Whaley. First down. Got it. And he takes it. And he's shy. Oh, missed it. Oh, the iron on Kine. How do you play this? He's playing with a three defensive back structure. Five looking for some help. Nice. That pass That's is incomplete. It's the same thing. Drone this combination. Try to beat us with coverage. Five pass is caught. Yep, it's a first down to Ben. Because at some point they've got a rush like they're blitzing now. That ball is popped wow. into the air and intercepted. Cole Goodbow. And he lumbers down inside the 25. Well, he number 94 says, I'm no lump of coal. I'm going to show you I can grab this thing and then do a little something with it after. I'm oh, bad it to baby. myself. With zero points. Sims gets out of there. First big run of the night for Hawaii. And Sims is near the last time they stayed on the field on fourth down. Shager throws first down again down inside the 35. Clock's going to expire right as they get it off. Shager steps up. Throws incomplete. Swan steps out of the trouble. And right at the line of scrimmage over the top complete. Tonight and they're at the 33 and we could have a free, a free play. play. For Vandy and a free place, a touchdown as it's caught by London Humphreys. Makes total sense. On a third and one, Shager's going to throw the deep ball. He's got a one on one battle and it's caught. Wow. Shager throws underneath, grab made, spinning in the end zone, touchdown. Pofle Ashlock. On second and 14, there's a good ball. On a second and eight. Swan back to the air, back to completing passes. This time it's Will Shepard. This possession. Taking four minutes off the clock, trying to keep the drive alive to McGowan incomplete for the Rainbow Warriors. He's going to throw the deep ball behind the defense. Caught. Three game on the line. Hawaii trying to stay in it on a fourth and three. And it's Ashlock making a move to the end zone. Touchdown. Next to him, low snap. Morris, touchdown. And it bounces off a of Vanderbilt player. And will they give it to Cynical in bounds? They will. That's Will Shepard. That's a couple of drops we've seen in this game. You see Cynical is definitely. Oh. Yeah, it's yeah, right, right elbow. elbow. Looks to the bottom of your screen with one receiver up top, and it is thrown behind Gamarion Carter and almost. What a way to stop the clock. Shager drifts, back throws, picked off. Stepping in front is to Ricky Wright, his second pick of the night, and this one will give Vanderbilt the win. They're faster, stronger. Daniels, ball's knocked out, and it's loose. I don't think that's a throw. I think that's a fumble. 
And the officials have it as a fumble right now. On the field is a fumble. We'll probably see in motion. High shot up and in. Touchdown, Kansas. Lewis fires it deep. Sideline. And it's caught. That's Campbell. Has time. Scrambles. Headed for the end zone. Can he get there? He does. Touchdown, Nevada. Daniels throws back across. That's Neal with the catch, and Neal scampers inside the 30, still on his feet, and Neal's five, and Neal leaps, and he's out of bounds at the one. Neal leaps, and he's in from the two. Lewis going to keep, race for the pylon, in, touchdown, Nevada. They move him everywhere. Daniels loading up and looking. Wandering, throwing, sideline. Oh! He caught it! Neal breaks a tackle. Back on his feet. Back in the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas. With the early on the on the field is a fumble recovered by Kansas. First down. This looks to be Kansas's oh. ball. Well, who gets the? If it's Barry Hill's recovery, he's in. But his teammate is out. Fourth down, they go for it. Williams stays on his feet. That go downfield. That was just a miscommunication. Williams fights. Touched. First rushing touchdown. <laughs> Dylan Hopkins hands it off to Corey Krosky Merritt, one of the top running backs. Oh, shit. Third and seven. Hopkins darts. There it is, Turbo. You were all over it with Andrew Erickson Absolutely. involved. Absolutely. He gets it. Big hole. Krosky Merritt accelerates. No doubt about it. Give it to Ja'Cory Krosky Merritt. Stiff arm to bounce off of one. Has the first down. Yeah. Won't go down. To take a shot. No. Instead, it's a run. Faison has the first down. Outside run. Cuts it back in. Big Utah State. The Breakers. Play action. Hopkins to work through the air. New Mexico down two score. Need to utilize him on the ground. Absolutely not. They said it's a pass. Hopkins corner route right there for oh. Hick. Second and ten. There's the run. Krosky Barrett. Big seam up the middle. First down. Then some. And he keeps it. A lead with Dampier. They throw it. They're throwing. Williams guns it. Bowman makes the catch. And act like you're running around. 24 combined penalties, 270 combined penalty yards. Will it take them anywhere just yet? Let's see if Levi can locate him on this drive. Levi looking right side, has to change his mind, chooses left, has strides, and runs in. First down. Devin Dampier comes in, that quarterback. The running threat. With the running back leading the way, Dampier spins and scores! Three, second and ten. Drops the snap! Williams runs! Left side, still has space, cuts it up, reaches, hit, scores! Utah State wins on a play that Williams drops! He's never had a guy get as many votes as Garrett Fountain. He plays hard and have a lot of purpose. Four-man pressure picked up, Lega, deep shot, and it's caught for the touchdown, Jalen Royals! He's 9 of 10 passing Petros for 144. He hands it off here to Booth! Breaks through and breaks in. Their side of the line of scrimmage. Maiden. Complete. Christian. And he's in. This from 42 earlier tonight. Marks drops the snap. He kicks it away off of an Aztec at San Diego State. He stands behind Maiden here on second down. Maiden again to throw. To the corner. And it's nearly intercepted. From the 28, Maiden, wide open, Penny, he's got it. Pick up the pressure. Legat taking a shot, Vaughn, right into the basket. San Diego State showing some pressure. They bring it, Briggs breaks through, a touchdown for Utah State. Is the running back, Maiden to throw, in the face of Heat, and it's intercepted. Larson in the second overtime ends it for the Aggies. Another draw. Madsen 
in touchdown from the 20 green and Genty his roommate is in there as well Genty brush loose Genty's got speed Genty's to the 40 Genty's to the 20 Genty is out of bounds Green, no one to hand it to, reverses course, darts outside, races, and he has it. That's a touchdown. Second and eight, Cordero. Time, a bullet, that's caught there. That's Nick Nash. 41-yard line. Robinson behind Cordero. Robinson first through, and he's got a nice game. Broncos show blitz. That's Mazzotti in motion. Cordero, time, fires, contact incomplete. What this game has been about on both sides of the ball. Final seconds, third quarter. Green, a long shot. McAllister's there, has the ball. The defense needs to make a play soon. Broncos, Green, breaks loose. Great move, touchdown. Plays and extend drives here. And Madsen does that with his arm. Madsen in the pocket. He's done it with his legs and he's got a lot of room. And once again, not his strong point. Green's back in. Uh -oh. He'll pull it. And Green up and over. In the backfield. Tenth play of the drive. Genty gets it. Left side. Oh, the hurdle. Genty inside the 15. Genty in the backfield. That's Smith in front of him. Play action. They're looking for Smith. He's got it. Touchdown. Cordero looks. Throws. Oh. Hey, McDonald's can hit this. Or if San Jose State jumps offside. There's the snap. There's the kick. On the way. Missed it. Let's see if they bring pressure again. They rush four. Cordero steps to the pocket. Gonna scramble. Doesn't have a line in front of him. Steps back. Fires. And it's dropped. Oh, goodness. Blitz comes. Everybody coming. Cordero's in trouble. Escapes. Cordero stumbles, goes down, it's over. Down. Keen to pass, caught for the touchdown. Third down, goal to go. Keen to pass, back of the end zone. Eric Brooks with a tremendous Keen. Keen pass to Sherrod, diving. Bro. Yards on the reception, P. Nice cut back here for Vincent Davis. Ayava delivers to the end zone. LV. On third down, they'll hand it off to Sherrod again, and he'll come up short. And UNLV mount the late comeback. Big run. Game hinges on this. Ayava to throw. Caught for the first down. Off the clock here, 24 seconds. Mayava takes the snap, taking a shot in the coverage, caught along the sideline. Mayava to pass to the end zone, off the hands of the intended target, McKee. Unbelievable. Snap it quickly. They do, here comes the blitz, pass picked off. Lavelle Bailey. He's tough to bring down, so why not keep feeding? Malik Sherrod bounces off the tackles like a bowling ball keeps on going. Sherrod down the sideline and done. Touchdown. For 11 on third downs. Blitz for Utah State. Switzer jumps to try to time it to bat it. Fife keeps it with his wheels, dies forward, and he should have. Nine conversions on third down. Fife off the back foot, but gets it in stride to Brooks. Sherrod is in that wing position. Backwards pass. Gill will throw for Watson. Over the shoulder catch. Booth maneuvers to behind the quarterback, setting up this play action. Lega steps into it. Laser beam is caught. With four picks coming in. Screen. Who's going to catch it? Stick off. That's Bridges. And right there, that's a textbook open field tackle. Got Scotty in the spring. Lega down the seam. back going for two reversing to Royals fakes the throw Royals runs and gets in and you see it there down at seven and he's going to work with the throw flicks the wrist unleashes and caught for the tip by great pass on the wheel around Sherrod up the sidelines it's Vincent 
inside the 10. 26. Almost blocked, of course, Utah. From the 15, oh, high snap. He somehow grabs it, reverses field, gets positive yards, and then some. Play caller's dream, but Lagat drops it again. This has been a wacky drive. So Lagat goes deep. Ball catches it inside the. Lagat hands it off. What a juke! Bazon stays up. Bazon dives. Touchdown, Utah State. From the 28. Five guns. Moss catches. Back. On second and two, Fife wants to of the screen. Johnson, meet that Freeman. Sherrod has another crease. Step on, slips through, and scores. In motion. Laga gets a three man rush. Lane gets the catch over the middle. That is a first down. Second down and nine. Laga has a clean pocket. Guns oh. it, and it's blocked. What an interception by Morris. Well, they're not going to get a chance. This Larrier with Michelle on his back is in the end zone. Three. Peasley. Blitz comes. Rolling. Looking back. Throwing across. Touchdown, Cowboys! And he missed it. It was blocked. Wyoming has loaded the box. Jones pitches. Eldridge breaks the Same sense. Beasley setting, firing, and has a man. That's short of the first down, though. Cluster. You have time. You need to be urgent. Just don't rush. It's third and one, and they're going to throw. Beasley's throw in traffic. It's incomplete. Fourth and one. Got to get just past the 35. They'll throw it again. Blitz comes. Beasley's in trouble. Unloads, and it's over. The head of Wheeland. Air Force get teams by the Falcons today. Jones is going to keep it at Jones. I can help him. Down to the 11. Completions. We're almost at halftime. Looking to pass on first and goal. Williams gets away. Caleb Williams across his body and caught. They say touchdown. <laughs> A very proud Wildcat. Fafita in the pocket across the middle and a perfect strike to McMillan who spins toward midfield, is tackled short of midfield to making the tackle. So near midfield, handoff Coleman again and Coleman bursts through, there he goes. Jonah Coleman inside the 30, still trying to get him down and he won't go down until he's all the way near the 10 yard line. What a run. Two yard field goal try for Tyler Loop. Kick is up and good. Play fake. Williams trying to find somebody deep down the field. And now he's going to scramble again. Williams out in the open field. Gets by that defender into Arizona territory. Right as a receiver. Well, Connor does a good job picking up some pressure. Williams spins away. Still looking downfield. Williams will throw. He takes a big hit, and that's going to be a penalty against Arizona. Throw your hands up, run by the quarterback. I mean, heck, it was almost a targeting. Dietrich back in the game. Lloyd runs behind him. Touchdown. Now it's first and goal right back where we started. Inside the one. Williams did not get there. Still going, and he reached out. I think he got it. Touchdown! I think he got it. Connor Fafita here for second and five. He'll pitch it out right side. Coleman hits that hole on his feet to the 45 to midfield and gets dragged down, I think, by the face mask. Fafita looking left, throws, caught! Touchdown! Jacob Cowing! Coleman in the backfield. Fafita will throw and he converts. McMillan catches. We got a tie game. Nine. 
Fafida gets away from Alexander. Now he's going to run, and he's got all kinds of room. He'll run for the first down and more outside the 35. Being down, they get the ball snapped. The kick on the way, and that kick is hooking. It is no good. You don't score to not give the Wildcats a chance themselves. Williams in the pocket. Caleb Williams will deliver wide open Washington in the middle of the field into Arizona territory. Don't rush. Handoff. And this time over the left side. Still going down to the 10 and pushed out of bounds. And the ball's on the ground. A muffed exchange. Oh, my goodness. From 25 yards. Snap was high, and the kick is no good! A bad snap! Amazing. Now third and three, Williams keeps it. Caleb Williams to the 10, to the 5, touchdown! Overtime, Noah Fafita throws over the top. Cowing there, touchdown! That didn't take long. Fafita option, pitches it late, the ball's on the turf. It bounces to Coleman, he picks it up and gets the first down. Slot, Fafita looking middle and it's caught, touchdown! And that is Cowing. They'll play fake, Fafita, he's got Cowling. He'll throw, knocked away! And in 19, Williams steps up. Williams throws middle wide open. Pass caught, and that's going to be a first down. Mario Williams. Get the ball snapped quickly. Jones up the middle. Touchdown. Williams rolling right. Caleb Williams is going to try to run. Now he throws, and it is incomplete. Gets the ball snapped. Rolling right. Trying to get there himself, and I think he got out of bounds. No, they say he got there. I thought the ball was on the wrong side of the pylon. They pitch it left. Williams goes down. And USC wins the game. Has to bring it forward. Borgay to throw for it. Dropped. Sprint left. Penix goes across his body. Caught. First down, Washington. It is up and good. Take the pit. Got him four game. Wide open Badger. Four game. Going for it. Incomplete. And a flag comes in late. Contact is real legal. Second down. Muhammad couldn't believe the flag came out. Look at the grab. Oh, wow. Um, wow. That's uh, that's tough. That's two grabs, the yeah. chest and the shoulder pads. Surprised the back judge allowed that to be the field judge right there on the sideline. He can't see that. See if they bluff out of it and play zone. Four game. Oh, oh, Picked oh. off. Huskies going the other way. Washington. Borgay down the middle, wide open, Stovall. And Pressure, Borgay on the move. First down, Arizona State. Borgay tipped, incomplete. Two tight ends in the game for Cal, Mendoza. Now it's a scramble play, it's a run play, Mendoza, he kicks the pylon, but let's see. And now the bear push gets Mendoza in the end zone. Yep, there it is, touchdown USC. Lloyd, and Lloyd is in for the USC touchdown. Middle. And a 425 to play. And Lloyd busting out. Lloyd! Inside the 10. Austin Jones walks in. 
Liberty's defense all crowding the line of scrimmage. They're not respecting anything deep right now. Hunter. And Hunter runs it out. That's going to be a first down at the 48 for Kemp. With three timeouts. Let's see. Four rush. Mendoza in the middle. Hunter's got it and more. And Cal. Look at this. Look at this. He's not even on the depth chart. Swing to Thomas. That's some blocking. Thomas blocking. Thomas touchdown. Mendoza looking. Scrambling, looking, has to try something. No! Jet sweep, touchdown, Cardinal! Daniels looking to throw, got his man. And a good hit, short of the end zone. A moment ago, they've got 97 yards to go. Daniels finds his man. Iowa Manor, still on his feet. One man to beat! He's going to score the Cardinal touchdown. Empty formation. Daniels surveys incomplete. Yes. He's been killing it. The guy that came out of the portal, a transfer, who's endured two ACL surgeries. That pass complete. Travis Hunter going to be stopped on the same sidelines of practice. Also recruiting him. Hands it off. Little flea flicker. Has a man downfield in traffic. Almost picked off on the state. EJ Smith in the backfield. They're going to pass. Daniels downfield. Back shoulder fade. Caught. Io Manor got real estate in front of him. One guy to beat. Races. Scores. Touchdown, Stanford. This is where Shadur Sanders has to take over this football game. Under duress and sacked. Shallow. Sanders retreating in trouble. And Stanford will take over on downs. Back at the 31. Daniel's going to be sacked for personal foul, unnecessary roughness, defense, number 12. 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. Down here at the bottom of the screen. You had him before. Looking that way again, now going through the progression. At the 8, complete. And out of bounds at the 2. Going to keep it. Touchdown, Stanford. Sanders. Clean pocket. Shot down field. Got a man. Caught. Anytime they can get him singled up. Into the end zone. Touchdown. Hunter held on to it. Third and goal. Daniels into the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Farrell. The 13th here. Shador Sanders gets rid of it quickly. Caught in the flat. And plenty of room. First down run by Dylan Edwards. Continue to go to him in this situation. Shador downfield. Overthrows it. In the nine. They punt. Looking at the coffin corner here. <laughs> and that's his coffin <laughs> corner as it gets. Wow. Daniels. Delivers a strike to his tight end. Roush picks up the first down and then some. Iomeyer and Hunter at the bottom of the screen. Hunter jumped it, but Iomeyer got there first. What a grab for the first down. Unbelievable. Then Daniels complete. For the tie. Drills it. And we're knotted at 36. <laughs> From the slot, man, he has done it all. Hankerson with a yawning hole. Inside the 10 at the 9-yard line. Nine. Sanders. Touchdown! Got it! Antonio! And down here. And that's where they come. Battling. Oh, oh what my a grab! Gosh. What a highlight! <laughs> this. The throw. The throw. He takes it, he traps it to his back of his helmet and pulls it off of it. Dropping out. Lobs it up high for Hunter. There's the flag, incomplete. Sanders going to pass it. Can't find anyone. On the move. 
Finally gets rid of it. Picked off in the end zone. Losing streak. With a strong second half for the win. The Cardinals storm into Boulder. Do not take the timeout. So the clock ticking with 14 seconds. Licks it in the third in the end zone. Lost it for Ferguson. One-handed touchdown catch. Great field position. Four-man rush. Ball out. Caught by Franklin who runs a great route. Knicks against the four-man rush. Beautiful throw downfield. It's Jordan James in stride. Knicks scrambles. Fires to the end zone. Low throw. Touchdown. Terrence Ferguson for the second time tonight. Pressure on third down. Penix off his back foot. Overshoots and it's intercepted. Knicks. Flushed, scanning, and throw right, an interception through it right to Mish Powell. McMillan in the backfield, along with Adams on fourth down, Penix is on the move, running out of time, and dropped. Nix on second and three, pump fakes, has some space. Pump fakes again, takes off, Bo Nix rambling down the sidelines, has blockers all the way down near the 10-yard line. Three receivers bunch there, James is the back. And Jordan James makes a cut and scores, and Oregon on top for the first time in this championship game. Caught eight balls the first game, has seven tonight. Penix. Downfield, and the catch is made by McMillan. A long... Penix, hit as he throws, the ball is out there, no whistle yet, the Ducks fall on it, and the signal, you don't think the arm's coming for it right now before it's hit? I mean, I get it, you say it's close, I mean, I think if... That's why you make the big bucks, Billy, what do you got for us? Well, I, I would have ruled a fumble on the field, you've got an argument there that the hand... Probably moved about two inches forward. Not an argument. What's the call? What, what are they calling? Well, forget, forget the field. I mean, I, I know it was ruled Upstairs. on the field. What is Brian Brown in the replay booth, the back 12, saying? They're going to turn it over to a pass. Incompletion? Incomplete. Penix on the move. He keeps it. And he's a infrequent runner, but so Receivers bunched over to that side. Johnson again. Bulldozes in. They're probably going to bring him. Pressure comes. Good call by Penix. Over the middle. It's to Polk again. Penix lobs it into the end zone. Touchdown. Quentin Moore. Three man rush. Nix into coverage, delivers over the middle and squeezed it in to Trayshawn Holden. Holden still running down inside the five. Touchdown. Lining up like he's going to onside kick it over here to the left. Gets the hop. It's a kangaroo hop, and it's out of bounds. So has time. Short throw. Catch made. McMillan first down. Washington. The clock down, and then you would expect punt it. Johnson makes a cut. Forget about that. Johnson, first down, slides down, and the Washington Huskies are going to win the final Pac-12 championship. The games with Penix in mind, they notice number eight, too. Here's a screen. Martinez has a couple blockers. Patiently makes a cut, and is still running. Damian Martinez finally tracked down at the 45, but he... From the pocket pressure, hit as he throws. It's caught down inside the 10. Five. Martinez. And on play 16, the Beavers reach the end zone. A keeper, and they get it. And Uyanga Lale still running. Spins free. First down, and much, much more still won't be denied. Down near the Huskies 30. Second and 12. Trying to protect the quarterback who flips it underneath through a screen. And taken off and galloping down inside the 20-yard line. Boy, Angelale running for his life and has to throw it away. Actually, on the kick. I don't know if he's named for Atticus Finch. He's able to get it through right there. Play clock at one. 
Penix backpedaling, escaping, and has to just heave it downfield. What a creative play in the move to Westover. Under pressure, long throw, the catch is made beautifully. DJ looking to throw, cross the field, catch made, and another first down. Silas Bolden grabbed it. They crowding the line, showing pressure. They bring it. Uyangalale, backpedaling, backpedaling, over the middle, incomplete. Field. Penix looks to the other side and goes to his reliable weapon. When in doubt, dial up Odunze. Kick here in a tie game, but it's a chip shot. And he drills it. The Hornet defense getting in there. Lampson has a man open and connects Medea Rubin to the West Coast from Syracuse. Play action, plenty of time. And delivers a strike downfield to E.J. Smith. Team All-American. Off the boot. And he whistles it on his third year of starting on the line for Sac State. His knee hit the turf. He got low, but it's Lamson with Butler in the backfield. Play action. And now he's gonna tuck it. And he gets the first down down at the 35. And now Cardi. Perfect again. Goes second and eight. Bennett tucks it. Makes a man miss. He jukes in Claire and he is off all the way into at American River JC. Gets it away, and it is. Needs a play. Lamson finds Farrell. Fakes the handoff to Fulcher. Getting pressured. And flips it to Fulcher in space. All the way into the end zone. Lamson, plenty of time. Unload. Defender who thought he was celebrating an interception. Fourth and 26. Lamson unloads, trying for Urasic, tipped up. Take the pitch. Ball is loose. Utah is on it. Bingham High School. Fano and Tafuna. Moore right down the middle. Right on target in stride to Loya. It's really the ball game here. More play action. Here comes Fano again. More waving everybody downfield. He launches. Oh. It's caught Carson Ryan. More end zone. It is a touchdown, and Norwood held on this time. Memory, Dante Moore, part of that. The freshman hit and drops. Second and 18. He feels it again. He goes down again. Dante Moore. He's drilled again. Utah's defense absolutely swarmed all day long. Trying to avoid back-to-back -back losses. Wilkins shoots it down the middle. Taj Washington again. Up. And Riley expecting more possessions in this game. That ball is on the way and through. So Lynch. Here comes Bird again. Intercepted. Now USC will go for two, trying to make this a three-point game. Caleb Williams under pressure, big time to rest, and this is incomplete. Teams that just cannot quit each other. Barnes sends the heat, throws it again for Baki. Those ball bit parts. Sione Baki with speed to the outside. He turns the corner. It's a first down in the red zone. Former Colorado Buffalo sends it on its way and through. Nine on third down. Best third down defense in the country. Ellis has eyes on him again. Williams escapes to the outside. Got a throw. He does. And it is caught by Singer. Utah, USC. Aspirations on the line. This one out wide. Mario Williams. Little ballet down the sideline. Washington in motion. Williams lost the ball on the throw. This is a live football, and he got back on top of it. 
contested throw to his left. But the ball, absolutely, you're absolutely right, just flies out. It is a fumble. And Avasa nearly comes up with it. Riley wagering on his defense. His kicker first, Dennis Lynch, sends it through. Barnes missed him! This offense. Bowmeister to punt. Branch to receive. He wants a chance at this. Here he goes. The electric freshman, Zachariah Branch! Down the sideline, it's Bishop! And he just had enough of an angle. Williams running, looking for the end zone. He's there. USC is all the way back. Between USC and Utah, Caleb Williams giving ground, throwing for the end zone and incomplete. Bryson Barnes to throw. He's got it across the middle. Mikey Matthews cannot come up with a first down. There's a marker down as well. Personal foul. Roughing the passer. Number 90 defense. High contact. 15 yard penalty. Automatic first down. I don't see this as targeting in terms of him truly leading with the head. I see it more. Third and two. First down is what matters. Here we go. Direct snap. It is a first down for Jackson. Second down for Barnes. Pressure coming. He runs. Barnes across the 40. And he's inside the 20. It is good. The Utah Utes sink USC once more. Run it a lot to force matchups out of that bunch formation. Pax deep ball has been high sometimes today. That one is right there. Oh, Dunze. He boots it away. It is on the way, and it is good. Fourth and two. Play action Penix. His throw is there. As many targets today as Odunze. He's on the sideline this time. Penix. Cannon shot down the middle. It's a touchdown, Odunze! Barnes throwing, intercepted! To Butala down the sideline! He is gone! Oh, he dropped the ball right at the goal line. I mean, he drops this well early. This isn't close. Really on the field is a fumble. And a recovery by the defense. Jackson won't get out of the end zone. Down and one. Johnson back there. Johnson jostled. He's got the first down. And get away from this danger. Pressure coming. Panic fading. Throw. He got it there. Years and two years as head coach is here. Panic sees carnage in front of him and then slides. Oops. High snap. And this is blocked. Fourth and ten at Husky Stadium. Here comes Trice. Barnes staggering. Throwing. Intercepted. I believe they can get a stop here. Three runs. Penix has time. Watches. Touchdown. Screen. To the tight end, Devin Culp. Big fella running through tackles. Trying to run over people. He's in Michigan territory with another first down. Four yards short of the first down by Josiah Stewart. Have to get back within a touchdown. Gross drives it right through. Culp comes back to get the screen. Gets a block. Jalen Polk, pushing and crowding the line on this third down. McCarthy dodges some pressure, escapes, and J.J. McCarthy is still running, rambling out across the 30. That's his longest run of the season at 22. Keeper again. This time, no scramble. They just feed the hot hand, and the quarterback. Final 35 seconds of the quarter. Westover's been a reliable target, and he maneuvers nicely after the catch to get a first. McCarthy pulls it and finds Loveland over the middle. And the tight end galloping deep in the Husky territory. They'll take a chance on this guy from Idaho. And Jim was sold. 
McCarthy on the move. Finds Wilson, and Roman Wilson turns the corner. Last two years with McCarthy at quarterback. It's a very crafty play calls down here, and said they just handed this time to Quora. Steps back, breaks a tackle, touchdown Michigan. Watching downfield, Odunze is wide open. A bust. And one of the best DBs in the country. Penix. Looks the other direction down the seam. It's intercepted by Sandra Still. Mikey Sandra Still has a couple of blockers. A convoy. Michigan. Set up inside the 10. He's got it. Michigan barrels in. Michigan muscle. The decisive factor. Fourth and 10 backpedaling and it's incomplete. For Washington. Oh no, it's five. Here they come. Cam Ward near side. And Williams could. Oh yes, he did. After the game of seven, he's looking Polk's way. Instead, it is going to be Polk. And it is intercepted by Jaden Hicks. Big hole, Nakia Watson veering outside and taken down by a line. Janikowski on the way, it slices wide. Nixon is in, Penix flowed to his right, throws to his left, guess what? Penix a pump, and go into traffic with Lampkin. Oh, Dunze, what a reaction! From midfield, Cam Ward over the top down the seam, nearly intercepted, and is off the deflection. About the craziest bounces and breaks at moments you could never. Edge once again, fourth and three, Cam Ward going this way. It's Revere, the tight end who just came into the ball game. Ward down the middle, got it to Kelly. Victor moved to the outside, now he comes back in, and scores! 115. Here we go, Penix wanted Odunze, and he's hit, and he spiked it into the ground. Cam Ward scanning, backpedaling, climbing the pocket, Ward throws, double coverage incomplete. The game here, they will go... Oh. And they're going to go the other direction. Oh, it's Odunze. Rome Odunze. Johnson right up the middle first down. For the win. It is good. Jalen Milrow has been very clutch all season in situations like this. He's got the football, goes straight up the middle, and barges down near the goal line. Through the hole. First and goal, playing with tempo. McClellan walks in. Alabama on top. It's a couple of quarterback pressures. Milro keeps it, breaks the tackle of Sam Brasil on the edge. Loses the ball, rolling around, and it looks like the Wolverines have it. Offense has been completely stagnant. Since the first half, where they pitch it out, and they find Roman Wilson has been waiting to make an impact play. Got it down, but already in field goal range. Here's the flea flicker, and it's a misfire. Turner from 49 to tie this game. It's hooking, and he missed it left. She stalled, missed the field goal. And now McClellan spinning free, running hard into Michigan territory. Michigan brings the pressure this time, and for the first time in the second half, they drop Milrow to make the lead seven. And he will drive it inside the right upright. Timeouts. McCarthy, wide open. Catch made by Corum. First down and much more. Weaves his way into Alabama territory. Flags come in on the tackle. Three minutes. Keeper. McCarthy gets the edge. J.J. McCarthy scoots down inside the 35, is tackled. 
Play fake. McCarthy scanning downfield and throws it high. And Wilson's got it. Roman Wilson weaving down inside the 10. Ocean's over. Keeper. And they pitch it to him. Touchdown as Wilson walks in. Try to get the receivers to change position. Milrow snaps it. Steps up and scrambles. And will be brought down after about seven yards. Get a first down. That's right. Alabama trying to get to around the 35-yard line of Michigan. And the catch is made. Is the quarterback hesitant to pull it and go? He had a chance maybe on that last play. See if they do spy him. On third and 11, the ball is out quickly. Catch is made, but no first down. They use a timeout. Finally, they get him on the field. They only had 10 out there. You're exactly right. High punt. And it's muffed again. And picked up at the one-yard line. He gets big yards. Three Michigan tight ends in the ball game. They hand it to Corum again and makes the cut. First down. Spinston scores. Blake Corum puts Michigan on top in overtime. Keeper again. Melrose straight up the middle. Breaks a tackle. First and goal, Alabama. That's Williams in motion. Low snap. Melrose stopped. Michigan makes a stand and comes up with a milestone playoff victory. On second and ten. Pressure on Jefferson. Stepping up and gets out of there. He's got all green in front of him. Jefferson inside the 30 and finally tackled by Dallas Turner from behind. Jefferson pulls it back, fires into the end zone, pulled in for the touchdown by Satania. Run the ball and run quarterback runs. When you get him in third down, you got to get off the field. Uh, thank you, Coach. Thanks. Interesting in the fourth quarter. Alabama bringing five defenders here. Jefferson going to take off. He's got running room. He's across the 40, and he's to midfield, finally wrapped up and brought down. Right, Alabama stacks the box, bring pressure. Jefferson in trouble, hit by Arnold. Jefferson won't go down, though. He gets out of there, and he dumps the ball off. It's caught inside the 20-yard line and all the way down to the 10. Jefferson with time. Receiver is there. It's caught to Binion. It's a touchdown for Arkansas. Jefferson fires and diving is Armstrong getting in for two points. After that loss to Texas week two. Going to keep it on the ground and a first down and more for A.J. Green all the way out past the 30. Jefferson to the air. Gets hit. And down he goes. They faced more adversity maybe today than they had in the previous wins during this now five-game streak. Thorn. Throws a slant, got his man on the run, Javarius Johnson. Johnson to cut back to midfield of the 30, or near it. Second and six, Peyton Thorne's got a man wide open. And a walk-in touchdown for Javarius Johnson. Right in the thick of another one. Jalen Milrow, double clutch. And now he's going to keep it. And he's going to get a first down and quite a bit more. Did he step out of bounds? I don't think so. Nope. Milrow, a little short crossing route to Isaiah Bond. And Bond's got another Bama first down. In the Tiger backfield on second down and seven. And Peyton Thorne's going to keep it big opening for the quarterback. Out across the 40 to first down. Auburn for the backfield. Hunter, that is. Empty set. Peyton Thorne, quarterback draw all the way. And Thorne inside the 20, the 10. First and goal, Otter. To give the Tigers a four-point lead. It's up. It's good. Milrow on second and 11. In trouble. And down he goes. Milrow again in trouble. Dances away, trying to turn on the Jets. He does. And hit right at the... First down marker. And they're going to toss it to Williams. Rodell Williams has got a first down. That's all it is. But there's a lot of airspace to cover for Milrow. Still looking. Firing. Near corner. It's caught! Touchdown, Alabama! Isaiah Bond! On a fourth and a mile! We always keep thinking... We've seen it all. 
And we never have, have we? Tied with a three-man rush. Peyton Thorne. Ball is out in the end zone. Picked up by Auburn, but it might end up being a safety. The ball is still out, squirting around. The receiver's trying to get back to the line of scrimmage, which is the one-yard line with one second to go. Thorne lofts one out. It is intercepted. Terry and Arnold will end it for the Tide, maybe with a touchdown. Daniels is the most outstanding college football player this year. Here is Hanson. And Hanson getting free. And look at the redshirt freshman tight end with that LSU offense. Second and five, end around. Ricky Pearsall. Here goes Ricky. And the Gators, what a response. Ricky Pearsall, touchdown. Cook, wide open and burden again. And fighting for extra yardage as Luther Burden the third. And he does just that. Third and five. Mertz steps up. And he's going to try to run for the first down. Wow! Puts the shoulders down twice. Split defenders. And it is a first down, Gators. And just after handing that football off, so much pain grabbing that left shoulder area. Ball's loose! Ball is loose! Mazoo's got it! Play action. Cook. It's going to go down to Weiss. And Theo Weiss, he is a speedster who gets free. Down the sideline he goes. M-I-Z. Putting it right on his face mask. And now Brown to pass again downfield. Great effort. Jackson goes up and brings it down. ETN's going to walk right in. And it's been played that way all night long. Here's Cook on third and seven. Pressure up the middle. Tries to extend the play. Trying to turn the corner. And Princely Uman Mielin tracks him. Brown's going to pull it. Brown's going to turn the corner, and Max Brown is striding inside the 20 to take the lead for the upset-seeking Florida Gators against number nine, Mizzou. 35-yard attempt, and put it through for the Gators. Cook with time, and he gets it complete to the 40-yard line to Miller. It'll be a top 10 tumble if he doesn't get it. Fourth down. Gotta have it, and he gets it! Luther Burden to third, and not only that, but they're in range to win it. Remember, he hit a 61-yarder to beat K-State. Now they're at the 40. That would be a 58-yarder. Cook trying to shorten that distance, and the clock will stop with the completion to Miller. They can clock it here. Put themselves in position to win it. And they do with the by Mevis. And Mevis drills it. Motion and Kendall Milton in the backfield, but it's back to throw on first down. He's going to air it out long. And Arian Smith has got it at the 20 yard line. Dominic Lovett settles in in the slot. Carson Beck looks one way, in trouble. Throws on the run into traffic, almost picked off. And it's up, and it's perfect. Right down Peachtree. Defense will come after him. They do with five. Milrow. This time after. they get to him. They're in field goal range. You hey, move. Milrow doesn't think he was down. And I don't know if I heard a whistle or not. The referee called him down. Rolling on the field as the quarterback was ruled down. You're right, Gary. Absolutely right. I was looking at the right center. Rosalie Jack Saint will come in and join the group in tight. They're going to come with the end around of the ball. I think Georgia, no, Alabama's got it. Milrow, somebody's in his face as he lets it go, and Burton, did he catch it? Three more on, and a kick from 27 is good to force Burnup to kick. On the run, 
on the catch. Anthony. A nice return. He pulls it. He fires it. Back shoulder incomplete, but a penalty marker down. Beck throws. McConkey at the one. Play action pass. Nobody defend. Quarterback sneak. Touchdown. The motion across the field. Milro looking right. Now scanning the field. Throws late. Got a man wide open over there. It's Bond again. And Bond's got a first down. With some tempo here on third down and two. Milro pumps. In trouble. A shovel pass to Bond again. And a first down. Seven minutes to play. From the 12-yard line. Milro. Going to lob this one over to Bond again. Isaiah Bond. Touchdown, Alabama. Nope. Handoff. No, I don't know about that one either. I thought he got in late. He did. Touchdown. All again if they don't pick this up. Edwards. This time he's got it and he comes out the back end. Go and hurry up as they got it to the 26-yard line. Back, back to work. Carson fires in the middle. Got it. Complete Brock Bowers. That is the only receiver. Second man through is Kendall Milton for the touchdown. And now Bond, his favorite guy, on the move. And he's going to run it, and he's going to come up big. Jalen Milrow. And he wisely hits the deck at the 45-yard line to keep the clock running. And Milrow will keep it again. It's his game right now. That's it. Here's Davis. Good burst there, and Davis with a spin. A first down and plenty more. Six more, in fact. Touchdown on a 31-yard run. That is the guy. Fake to Braswell. Come back to Leggett. Makes a couple guys miss. Got a convoy. And he picks up big yardage for South Carolina. Then mark him out at about the 17. Lake Lock late. Rattler wanted to change it. Here comes pressure. And he fires in zone for the score. And South Carolina jumps back in front. Leary over the middle. Batted again. That time it's Tonka Hemingway. And South Carolina will take over. And they're going to win this game and have one chance to play for bowl eligibility. The quarterback sneak with a push for Daniels from Josh Williams behind. No signal yet. That is a touchdown for LSU. Point game. It's got plenty of distance. And it's good. Straight ahead goes Diggs. At the five, at the goal line, he's in for an LSU touchdown. Play action. Dart. He'll take off. Right down the middle of the field goes Jackson Dart. Leaps over. Judkins at the 10. Judkins at the 5. Powers his way to the goal line. Is he across? Yes. That's an old miss touchdown. Dart with a pump fake. Dart shovel pass. Caught short of the goal line is Trey Harris. Daniels looks that direction. Has time. Now it collapses. He lost the football. Got it back. And he's down. Bentley. Finds a cutback leg. Jukes another man. He's got a first down and more. All the way out to midfield. He's showing you his skills on full display tonight. This might be a free play. Jaden Daniels. He's going to take a shot. Why not? It was a neutral zone infraction. The catch made by Brian Thomas. He's got another touchdown. Long throw. Hauled in by Trey Harris. Breaks a tackle. He's got a first down. Jukes down the sideline. Carries a tackler. Down to the 31 yard backfield by Sage Ryan can impact the running back. Quarterback sneak. Jackson Dart gets the push. Flags down. He's in for a touchdown. Daniels. A little pass on the flat to Mason Taylor. Near midfield before he's finally brought down. It's a light box a lot right now. And they're taking advantage of it. Jenkins. Almost broken. Everything on the ground so far. Now play action. One on one. What a catch made. Back shoulder. Trey. 
did that one on one on the outside, and they just took advantage of it. Here comes a blitz, the screen. Ulysses Bentley shakes and bakes, breaking tackles. Still on his feet inside the 15. They'll probably be thinking about using their timeouts. Harris makes a man miss. Painter, touchdown. Instead, it's Judkins. Reaches the ball out. Did he break the play? Backfield. Three man rush. Daniels gets it started with a crosser. Chris Hilton breaks a tackle. Hilton down the sideline. What a great start for LSU. Daniels looks left instead. Almost threw an interception. Quarterback run for Daniels. With speed to the edge. Drag down. Flags down. Digs the motion man. Daniels, he wants that shot into traffic to Diggs, and it's incomplete. In a situation with five seconds left, game on the line. Here it is, Daniels, under pressure, buying time, looking end zone. He's going to fire one into traffic, tap and complete. Wright keeps it, and he will dance his way into the end zone. Jane Daniels in the second half of LSU. Both backers blitz, and Johnson gets to him. Lewis will have a chance. First two miss. Finds the corner. Cuts back inside. And Lewis, the Memphis transfer. One of three through the air for Spencer Rattler. The carry on joiner. Lost the football. Mississippi State recovered. Football. Rattler keeps it. And even with a little hitch in his giddy up, he's going to stretch him out. And he scrambles inside the 10. And so third and goal. Rattler has plenty of time. And he gets taken down. Uh, second and goal. Anderson again. Slips through the first. Barrels through the second. Pushes to the goal line. Touchdown. State down 10. Looking for a comeback. Rodgers wide open. Caught down the sideline by Robinson. Temp already made for 49. This one has enough and Mississippi State gets three on the board to be able to find their offense and obviously Joe Milton still get it done they get South Carolina next Saturday night by the way uh, Mississippi State showed a lot tonight quarterback run Daniel right up the middle across the 50 and drag down inside and he is able to put it through Daniels looking downfield. He wants a shot for Brian Thomas out of the end zone. Touchdown. And dying by it. They got to get back committed to the running game. Cody Schrader breaks free. Nice cut back at midfield. Schrader being trapped to the red zone and finally shoved down. Schrader up the middle into the end zone. LSU thought. Draw. The C's part. There goes Daniels again. He's looking for the end zone. Touchdown. Daniels. He's got it. Bodies in defensively. An extra offensive lineman up front for Missouri. Bully ball touchdown. They'll try and run for it with Diggs. Or rather Daniels hopping over tacklers. And there he goes again. Caution for Daniels. He looks to throw here. Out of the pocket. Zips one down the sideline. Wide open for an easy walk-in touchdown for Neighbors. Cook. Blindside pressure coming and the ball comes out. All the way back to the 30-yard line. It's loose. A scramble for it. Missouri may have gotten it back, but a huge loss. Set from the end zone. Cook throws one. And it's intercepted. the reason why LSU is ranked with two losses and now they're going to climb in the rankings again after beating Mizzou. Well they need a miracle they need two scores they're going to let Mevis go out and try a long field goal and he can't connect. Milrow off the play fake again sets up in the pocket throws long look in middle of the field and he has a man what a catch just inside the near hash mark 
Reichard, good snap, good hole, kick is on its way, and it is good. Off the play fake, Dart steps up in the pocket, looking long toward the middle of the field, and it's intercepted! Arnolds brings it back across the 30, beautiful spin move across the 35, and he's up to the 42 before Franklin makes the tackle. It'll be first and 10 for the 33. Milrow, he's hit as he throws toward the end zone, has a man, hey, a leaping grab! He's got it! No, he's not in, he was off the field. And it's bobbled, the snap is bobbled, but Ty Simpson will run it in! How you describe downs? On second down, they'll throw again, this time to the near side. Pass is complete. Wade breaks a tackle inside Alabama's own ends. Ooh, they shovel it off to Bentley. And Bentley is out of bounds. He's got the first down. Davis has missed a 34-yarder. Good snap, good hold. Kick is on its way, and this time he got the height, and he got it through. He stays in the ball game off the play fake to him. Milro has time. Middle of the field. Pass is complete. It's Oots, the tight end. And they'll give it back to McClellan. McClellan gets to the edge. A burst inside the 25. He cuts to his right and gets inside the 10 down to the 8-yard line. And they go back to McClellan. McClellan assessing. Breaks one tackle into the end zone. So it's fourth down and eight. Dart looking to throw. Middle of the field. Pass is complete. He's got his man Watkins, and he's got a first down. Able to get anything going to know what to call next. Dart, middle of the field, passes complete to Watkins again. He's inside Alabama territory. They're going to pressure on fourth down. Dart, lofts one, passes complete to Bentley, and Bentley's got the first down. Dart on first down, looking to the right side, and his pass is caught. Wow, Dayton Wade with an unbelievable grab. Second down, Dart looks right. Oh. Pressure's coming, and he sacks Dallas Turner high in the air to take him down. And that'll do it. Rattler rolls. Juju McDowell again. Touchdown. And it's blocked. Partially blocked, and that is Smack's first miss. And two. Rattler looked over there, now throws, middle of the field, wide open, Omega Blake. Fake to McDowell, then they throw, and inside the 20, Joshua Simon gets free, touchdown! Oh, with a Braves fan over here, uh oh, issue with the snap, and Jeter is going to go down, and it's a 10-point game for 200 in the first half. This is a good ball, and past the 40 goes Pearsall. It's been quiet in the second half. Pressure off the edge very well. Six balls, 90 yards for Pearsall now. Mertz to Pearsall again, right near the first down marker. On fourth and 11, Mertz throws short. Boardingham breaks a tackle. First down, Gators out at the 35. Team down to the 35. And a good ball to Pearsall inside the 20. Second and nine, slant and boarding him again. Well get targeted. Mertz off the back foot, throws, incomplete looking for Pearsall. Gets it off with one, ETN, first and goal, Gators. Fake to ETN, rolling out over, boarding in, say what a catch. Touchdown, Arliss Boardingham on an overthrown ball. He sticks his paw up there. It's out of pressure, throws down the field to Pearsall. Caught midfield on a great one-on-one -on -one ball with Eamon Worry. 55 left. And a handoff to Johnson. Johnson, first down run, down to the 37, right on the edge. On the slant, thrown behind and caught off the carom. Down to the 15 goes Eugene Wilson. 
Second and 15, Merge pumps. Over the middle, Pearsall! Touchdown, Gators! Rattler just has to dump it off. Joyner. First down and out of bounds. Rattler drifts back. Throws down the field and picked off. The average plays about six seconds. Or he's going to take a safety. Yep. And run out with three seconds to go. From the 20 and McDowell. Actually, it's Joyner that picks it up at the 19. And they'll start trying to throw the laterals and it can't pull it off. Jermaine Burton in motion toward the ball. No low. Going to go deep. Lays it out there and he's got Bond. Isaiah Bond. Touchdown. Jace McClellan heading to the corner. Touchdown, Alabama. They need every yard they can get right now. Milton, backside pressure. Down he goes. The ball is out. It's going to be scooped, and it might be a score. It is. Campbell, touchdown, Alabama. This time, the sack around the corner from Chris Braswell. He scoops it, and he scores. Low snap. Milro had to go down to get it. Look out from behind. Throws. Got it to Burton. Touchdown, Alabama. Two minutes in the quarter. Milro loads, oh fires long, got a man out there. Burton's got it. Oh and slash wide receiver in a slot to the left. And now the backfield empties. Milro in a crossing route to Burton. Jermaine Burton, touchdown, Alabama. And stays in with Jalen Milro. He's having a career game. He's looking for more. And he throws another strike across the 30 to guess who Burton. Burton lost the ball, though. It and it is Texas A&M football. Second and eight. Johnson pockets collapsing. Down he goes. Turner is there. So is a Boigby. This is one. This one from 41. And it's blocked by Alabama. And they're going the other way. And it's Chris Braswell down the sideline. Alabama scores. There's a flag down back in midfield. Getting run over by the Alabama front wall. Johnson goes down and it's a safety. Well, the ball is actually out too. <laughs> you haven't done anything right. yet. Johnson loads, throws complete. Anaya Smith, Anaya Smith down the sideline and in. Touchdown and in. And whoo, just inside the upright on the right side. He press, he talked to Jenny about. Everybody taking a deep breath right now. AM's out of timeouts. Milrose in trouble. Going to throw and complete it to Chase McClellan. Did he catch that? If he did, it's a first down. It's a tremendous play, isn't it? Might be the play of the game right there. Let's see. His knee His was knees. down, yes. And the knee oh, comes up as he yeah, double clutches. Wow, Does that change things? Look at that. If he'd have caught it clean, it would have bust stopped right there. Can. Here we go. No row. Run into his right. Throws it. Not high enough, maybe. That is it. Look off, then look back. Shepard near side. There it is! Brings it in against Johnson. With Shepard in slot again. Swan. Knocked away. Good snap, kick, curves, Whoa. through! Now they got to score. Four man pressure, Mayave, wide open right. So the top of your screen is man to man coverage. Mayave's pressure, steps away from it, escapes another tackle, picks up the first down. Play clock down. Snap it with 11. Mayave rollout, deep shots. Touchdown, Rebels! Says the defensive coordinator in Arkansas. Third down. Swan down the seam. McGowan hammered down in plus territory. Experience to have a belt, but enough knowledge to be dangerous. See how he handles this on first. Love it. Fakes the pitch, slides. We're under two minutes, so the clock stopped. 
Swan, deep ball, near side, touchdown! This one has been wild. Rayava is picked! He threw it to Rinaldi! Rinaldi for Vanderbilt, rumbles to the 20. Third and nine, Smith. Near side run, does pick up a few to get to the 14. For Chilla. He missed it! For short distances. Second down and 10, Young Humphrey on the ground and with no timeouts. Vanderbilt trying to rip that Vandy, out. Vandy needs to call a timeout there. Ocean third and six. Run, does pick up the first down. And they get it off with 17 seconds. Mayaba, deep ball, near side, White's down, he catches it! Stiff ball, out of bounds, inside the 20 with nine seconds left. It's 35 yards. Snap, kick, Pizzano, connects! With four seconds left, Swan does get Shepard. Hook and ladder time. Clock expires. Stop made. That does it. UNLV with a deep ball. For Aguilar to Strowman. Play fake here. Is he taking a shot? He sure is. Back across and caught. Touchdown for Deshaun Davis. First and goal for Carolina, and Caleb Hood scores standing. Seconds of quarter three. And that is good. Straight drop. Flush to his right, going to loop it up, and it is caught! What a catch by Strowman! Left side. Stiff arm, and touchdown. Lindsay, I think we'll see a more methodical approach. Here's May, gonna fire it deep, and it's caught Jones at the 20. Inside the 10, first and goal, Carolina. Seven yard throw to J.J. Jones. Here is Hampton, chugging inside the five. Look at the white shirts he takes to the end zone. Touchdown for Amarian Hampton. Helping you with how this game plays out. Noel in the backfield, here's Aguilar. Hit as he throws, and it's caught, first down. Snap, spot. And it is good. Snap, spot. He missed it. First and goal. Noel at the left side. Touchdown, Appalachian. So made to work. Third and short. This is Hampton. Left side. Touchdown, Carolina. That's Morales in motion. May's going to keep it. Left side. Drake May scores. Snap, pressure, Aguilar, back foot throw, Davis, incomplete, no flags, Tar Heels win. Quarter, Bradley going right side, looking end zone, got it. And a stutter step there by Pritchett. It'll be Wallace, stopped. Facing a third and ten here, here comes the pressure. Rayner hit as he throws, but complete. Rainer throws near side and they'll stick with those four as Bradley protected well on the pocket and Colin Bradley to the air gets it to Webb got to get to the 45 yard line he does he'll this is a South Alabama program that hadn't been around a long time and for the Damian Webb again it loses to become a factor Rainer has completed his last two passes now make it three Across the middle, State's got to get it to the 30. Jags can't get to Rayner. He's got all sorts of time. Flares it out near side. And not. Jags rushing four. Side. Working on Fletcher. Watch. Touchstone. And Arkansas State is not dead. Rayner will take it himself. Quarterback draw. Does he get in? Yes. In the backfield. DJ Thomas Jones in it tight end. He's the lead blocker as Webb. Arkansas State. Now, it does bode well for the future. Uh, what Butch yards, one touchdown, and what officially about halfway through the first quarter, the Black Knights grabbed the first touchdown of the game. And if you're unfamiliar with Army's offense, the only yards you're going to see from them are rushing. But Coastal Answer is right back with a Jared Brown 59 yard touchdown pass 
from Jarrett Guest, who was back and he was starting for the first time since the game against Marshall. Army grabs two more touchdowns before ending the half. The first, just a one yard run by Bryson Daly, but the next one, yeah, this is something the Chanticleers will be thinking about for a while. Evan Crenshaw, he goes to punt the ball and just like everyone else, I thought it'd be in the air, but there it was, blocked and grabbed by the Black Knights and taken 37 yards by Jabril Williams. Army is up 21 to seven, but these teams are not going into the locker room yet. 58 seconds on the clock, Jared Guest throws a 31 yard touchdown pass to Jamison Tucker. So now Chanticleers are only down 21 to 14. But by the end of the game, the Shants, they're down by two touchdowns. And even with a 31 yard pass into the hands of Sam Pickney to make it a seven point deficit, it just wasn't enough. On third down, Jet Sweet. Granger, he's throwing back, has Wilson. Wilson down the sideline, first down and then some. Look at Wilson juke his way in. Touchdown, Old Dominion. McAfee in motion. Bryn, now on the run. He gets the first down and dives head first. And it's straight up the gut. Instead, Bryn will throw. Nowhere to go, he tried to push. Wilson. Up the middle, Wicks pushes through, gets the first down at the 35-yard line. And swallowed up quickly, Deshaun Davis. Five-man rush, Bryn almost intercepted. Wilson, hand off to Wicks. Dominion has all three. Georgia Southern starting from the 29. Bryn stepping in, fires across the middle to Burgess. He gets across and midfield. Nine. Bryn throws, pass is caught, and McAfee hangs on to it. Puts the Eagles in the red zone. Oh, and at the 18 yard line. Bryn. Throw it to the end zone to McAfee. Touchdown. On first down. They give it to Wicks. He has a hole. Second and seven. Wilson across the middle. Pass is caught. Granger across midfield. Wilson. Quarterback keep. Open room up the middle. Wilson putting his feet to good use. He slides at the end. Sanchez for the win. Right down the middle. And the Monarchs upset Georgia Southern at home on the Eagles senior day. Dropping back. Going down the middle. Touchdown. As he hit. Goes straight ahead. A lot of room there. Look at this. Uh-oh. All the way. Kind of in that diamond to the top, and he's running a fly route, and he goes into the middle. He's open to pass. Did he catch it, or is it in the yard attempt? It is true. And watched him. Third down. Pass is brought in. About two and a half. They got too many men on the field, so it's a free play. The pass is complete to Granger to the ninth. Ball is down, the kick is up. Kick is good. Whoa. High snap. Oh, oh. That's, a That's a safety, folks. He's in the end zone. Folks. Cranley wins it at the buzzer. For Wise, seven for seven at that distance. Well, no <laughs> doubt. <laughs> Aguilar. Over the middle, incomplete, and that was plays as well. They really did. Back out this side again and knocked out of bounds. Here comes the blitz coming out of the backfield, though. Good call offensively He's here on the near side. Looking to the right, though, underneath. That's good for the first down. Down play. Play action. Over the middle. Tight end. Wide open. Touchdown. This one do the Dukes. Here comes the push up front, and that is caught by Surratt, and it's good for the first down. That time just straight ahead, the power, and that's good for a first.
McLeod airs it out. Got Brown open. First down, JMU. It's Surratt. Surratt gets away. He's to the 30, down to the 26-yard line. Do so. And here's Lawton. Second burst to the edge. Advantage. And the handoff goes to, to, to Palmer. And if that's caught... Here he goes, there's space. Touchdown, James Madison University. Back to pass. Floating it over, and what a catch coming back to the football. Here comes the blitz, picked up. Into the air goes the receiver, Palouse. Comes the football, it's caught on the far side. First down and out of bounds. Hold is good, kick also is good. Bends out. McLeod lost it up. The catch! out the best play you've got play McLeod rolling rolling the end zone. it's good for two and it's through there from the eight lofting it underneath trying to get to the end zone oh let's see here is it a touchdown it is App State will win it gonna change it though because you've got to be able to see where that line, where the goal line is. He's just got to get into the white with the football. Nose of the football has to get there. Now, was it there right there, for example? Can't tell from that angle. It's hard to tell. This might be the best angle right here. And it's you, it's, it's inconclusive there yeah. to me to see whether it was or not. The round is confirmed. The game is over. So a touchdown is confirmed. App State snaps the Dukes. Undefeated streak here in 2023. Playing for the Wolfpack. Make that team for the tree, right? Second down, intercepted. Five-man rush. Looking to set oh. up the screen, and Fancher goes down. And run. First down, Allen back in there. He's got a seam. Michael Allen to the house. I'm back there for the Dolphins in his NFL days. Oh, that's complete. And it's Daryl Simmons with Rum. Oh, Fancher wow. looked like he was going to run. Instead, he connects with Jaden Harrison. And it's a Marshall touchdown. Oh, they're just such a fighter. Good kid. Morris has oh. Penix wide open again. Touchdown. There is a flag in the backfield. In the backfield. The gift to Payne around the right edge with Rum. Ethan Payne. Down the sideline and an open man, Simmons. Am I really your assistant? 26 yards. Just sneaks it in that right upright two. Back to the air. Looking long. Terrell Timmons. On a 40 yard attempt. Narvison got it. Down. Fancher keeps it. And he didn't get there. Play action. Morris runs out of time. Make their way to FBS. They're undefeated. Narvison from 27. Offense on fourth down attempts. Fancher to throw. And he overthrows his man. It's intercepted. Robert Kennedy takes it out of bounds near the 20. Of it run in on that action, it becomes contagious. Concepcion shows the speed, touchdown NC State. Add to that after this second down snap here. Hancher completes it across the middle. It's Caleb Coombs. Put it in the paint. Hancher under pressure, flips it up. It's a touchdown for Caleb Coombs. 89 total points, over 800 total yards. Uh, by North Carolina, Georgia should be able to take advantage of that. Off the injury timeout, Griffith slings one to the end zone. Morin's wide open, and there it is for the touchdown. Down first half. There goes Claiborne. He'll try to get to the edge, finally does. It's enough for a first down. Boy, it felt like that could have been a lot more for a moment in motion. A three-wide receiver set on second down. Warren will get it. 
Just caught a touchdown moments ago. Yeah, that could pressure. They send all seven. Plenty of heat. Griffiths was hit hard. James picks it off. James. Can he do it again? A stupid score and a pick six. Calmness and collectability. And guys, he's starting to panic. You can feel it down here on the sideline. We'll dump it off here. There goes Grimes. Wesley Grimes into plus territory. And he runs out. But quarterback showing a lot of toughness. Ellison will bounce it outside with a stiff arm. Stays in bounds. This would make it a two score affair once again. And on the way and true. Something. Banks five catches, 59 yards. Slow mesh. And the handoff, Claiborne. There he goes. The speed on display in Devon Claiborne. Grimes in the 6 2 frame. Manned up in the end zone front pylon. Griffiths will try to escape and buy some time, and he cannot. Sacked all the way back at the 20. Only one miss on the season, and that time bangs it through. Hits he's taken and delivers a strike. First down, Ellison to the edge, and then some. Justice Ellison stays alive. Me and Jamal Banks are so close. We've been here forever. It's our time. He'll heave one deep. He has a man. That's a touchdown for Morin. We saw a couple of those completions on this drive. Back to the air. Not this time. Roberts again. Ball pops out. Seven to go. Griffiths rolls out. Griffiths to the end zone. Banks is there. And there was some contact. He created the separation. Third down and five. Griffiths retreats into the flats. First down, Wake Forest. Williams. On fourth down, Wilson has it. Wilson's going to be sacked, and that'll do it. For Bauer. Goes across the middle. Catch first down. That's Pruitt again. The fumbled snap, he was able to get it back. Looked like a false start as well. And there is a flag in the end zone. Kind of looked like the left side of the wheel. So he'll be an option. And Carter Bradley will scramble himself. Has to get to the 34-yard line, and I think he does at the 35. So second down. Carter Bradley across the middle. That's a perfect strike to formation. And again, the fake handoff. Bradley looking for the downfield shot. Has man wide open, and it's caught. Well, Hardo, the lefty, all-time leading scorer in South Alabama history. The field goal is on the way, and it is perfect to the drive as they have the three-point lead. A lot of pressure coming, and Jace Bauer doesn't go down yet. Bauer, downfield, oh. has a man. Wow. Jesse Pruitt and Central Michigan. Once again, pressure off the left side. They're going to take a shot, looking for Colin Lacey. He's got the catch, and Colin Lacey is going inside the defender and coast into the end three, Colin Lacey. Here. South Alabama bringing pressure as Bauer rolls to the right. The catch is made, first down, Central Michigan. Here, big third down. Got to get across the 50 to the 49. Bradley will dump it off in space. First down, Jags, and then some. LaDamian. Get some yards, make this third and manageable. And now... Handed off to Kentrell Bullock. Pops out to the left side. Bullock, first down inside the 30 to the 28-yard line. <laughs> It'll be Bullock once again, and he'll get the call. Bullock makes a man miss. Bullock to the 20-yard line. One man to beat. Gets inside Bullock. Just in. Webb in the backfield. And Webb will get the call. Webb into the end zone. Touchdown, South Alabama. They haven't taken one now. Third down. Bauer. Get pressure. Has time. Gets Lukes across the 35-yard line. First down, Central Michigan. Anticipating a pass here from Jace Bauer. Bauer, right side. Has a man. Lukes, out of bounds. Dials up. Bauer, to the left side. Complete inside the five-yard line. And wrestled down and goal for Central Michigan. Bauer takes it himself. Bauer into the end zone. Touchdown, Central. How they score it. Wiles got it off to Frank Gorge. Utilized defensively. Wiles, slant pattern. Jacarius Caston's got it. Three one yard attempt for Andrew Stein. And it's good. Lane set to punt it away.
Ty Mims just made a mistake. A signal. Mario Easterly had the recovery. It splits. Make you think run. They're looking to the wheel. Wilson stepping up in the pocket. He's going down. Alabama as a freshman. Recognize he was not ready for big time college football as Grant Wilson drops a dime. It is. Looking for their third conversion. They've got it complete to Isaiah Page. Football. Yeah, that was a good rip. They had good leverage on the corner on the out route from the slot. Going to try it ball. again. Going right back to the well. This one is run outside the red zone. Wilson under pressure. Avoids one sack, but not another. Sanchez is on four of six in field goals this season. And he's true here. Quick decision. Looking to go up top. Is that caught? It sure is. My His ability to throw the deep ball. He's 7 of 16. He's not just lighting it up, but he's been efficient when he's done it. Keyshawn wicks into the end. Casting completes the reception 17 to 13. Frank Gore Jr. getting to the outside and inside the 30-yard line. Nice job in the past game, and he's been a key contributor tonight. Clark made a man miss. And this is the down. The second down is so critical. Wiles going to take off. Wiles to the five. A couple of years ago, Frank Gore Jr., did he get in, or did Jason Henderson make the stop? Man-to-man -man coverage. Wilson drops it off to Keyshawn Wicks. Wicks trying to get across the 11. Monarchs go to Wicks. He bounces back out of the pile. Wicks is trying to make. Harris looking to the other corner. Did he get a foot down? Touchdown. Or you have to go and try to get a nice chunk. That way you can make it a manageable fourth and goal. Finley, under pressure. By Cole Wilson. How big of a play was that, him not being able to score? They had first and goal from the seven. This is a 44-yard field goal to bring them within four. It's good. To make it a full touchdown and extra point lead. It's good. Roadrunners back up by seven. Final seconds counting down in the Alamo Dome. That I-35 showdown trophy staying right here. 32-yarder to make it a two-possession game. Able to connect. James Madison. Good coverage again downfield. Oh, what a catch. Watson down the sideline. Caught. Touchdown. Jabri Barber. Watson, the senior, once Lewis again. Able to turn back and haul that in against Devin Cole. As long as 37. So he's going for a season high. The sophomore has the leg, but it's no good. 17. McLeod keeps oh, and gets dropped. One timeout left, but this might be the game. Watson back to Lewis. Does he have enough for a first down? That's going to be the question mark. It appears as though he does. Season leading this team in workouts. Now he's trying to lead him down the field for a game-winning drive. Down two. 90 seconds to go. Coming back to the football. This time looks like saying so long from Troy. Quarterback. Now he goes back to running. There's a running back, and he's so freaky. Junior, 17 yards. Comes downfield and finds Bernard for a nice game. They have made a change at center as that pass is caught by Trayvon Colbert. Fields back to Bernard. A good job. 
He'll throw it to Colbert now. Seven passes. That one's bobbled. Fields trying again through the fingertip. Louisiana has lost 10 straight to Southern Miss, and they're trying to be bowl eligible tonight. Jacob Bernard's. Could this be that moment, Hudson? Into the end, true freshman. Down. And more ball comes out. Ball is knocked out. Louisiana has it. Carry Once. They fake it to Washington. Chandler Fields running out of room to roll. With Frank Gore. Stin with the catch. Shaking, raging. There goes Crawford. Trying to make it three for three. Jones with the catch. Away. Crawford in trouble. Into the end zone. 48 yards in his first start of the season. He will roll and toss it to Jacob Bernard, who hurdles a man. Then tonight. Hand off to Draylon Washington. First step. Crawford looking for an option just... That guy! And so they keep Louisiana... Seven yards for the lead. McCormick has the distance and nails it with the tight end Shaw in motion. Finley, nobody open. Huntington wraps him up in seven. Texas State, its own 21. Big run ripped off by, ripped off. First play of the fourth quarter is a field goal attempt. ULM going for the points as opposed, body rather, battling through. That was his 11th carry. This is his 12th and good for first down. There's Jeter right up the gut, and Jeter's going to spear it from the 41. This offense trying to get in gear. Finley dumps it off to Motti. He's good in space, and he darts out of bounds. Formation, Jeter in motion. Finley stands tall, pumps, fires, picks. Going down the sidelines, races by him, takes it back all the way. Up on six and a half to go in a two score game. Jeter to his right. Jeter exploding for a big run. Region here, you could get a field goal if you need it. Finley's going to run it. Finley down to the 12. Eight in coverage. Shot to the end zone. Reeled in and caught. Touchdown, Joey Hover. Rush coming. Finley spinning to his left. Looking to his right. Finley. Floats it into the end zone, incomplete. Quick strike, Hobart. And Hobart's in that formation. It's a run. On third down, Davenport slung down. Quarter. Now with the ball, down by five. Finley over the middle to the end zone for the touchdown. Life is a garden. Dig it. Here's Wright. Steps up. Right on the run to his left. Right down to the 40-yard line. Picks up in the passing game. 30 seconds left. Steps up. Flips that one. Complete. First down and more to the 40-yard line. Goes to the top of the screen. Blitz coming. Pass to Mortimer. At the 35 going left. Mortimer out of bounds. Right. Taking a lot of time, throws that one complete. Woolard out of bounds on the goal line. Right, flushed. Right, steps up, has to run it now and runs out of time. And that's it.